Tip your fedora at that. <laughs> hello, hello. Things are looking cool over here. I don't know. It's starting to look like a medieval village. Big tree. We have owl, headless owl. <laughs> We're actually gonna work on the tree today for once. Hold on, the music is distracting me. I keep making it quieter. Maybe I need to make my own. <laughs> my perception quieter. Maybe I just need to hear less. I have tea. I didn't drink it. I woke up sort of early, <laughs> earlier than normal today. And I'm kind of tired. I don't know. Usually I roll out of bed like... Like maybe four hours <laughs> before I start the stream, or three hours before I start the stream. But today it was like how many hours? Six hours. <laughs> so I'm getting like the afternoon, evening sleep times <laughs> when you've been awake for six hours. But usually I just... I've just woken up. I'm just getting awake by the time I start the stream. Can I always nap after stream? No, I'll probably be re-energized. <laughs> I'll drink this tea. Wake up, Minecraft! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But not today. Today I woke up... I walked on my treadmill that I bought <laughs> for like an hour. But I don't know, I walk on it kind of like slow because... I don't know, it's not like a full treadmill, it's like a walking pad and I've... <laughs> I know it's better to walk at a brisk pace for your cardiovascular health, but... I've been walking slow on it because... I feel like if I walk too fast, I'm gonna fall off. Because it's small. But I don't know. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Any walk is fine. It's true. Any walk is better than no walk. <laughs> Got a Naruto run on it. <laughs> I'm also just worried that it's like... If I run on it, it's loud. I don't know. <laughs> Gotta be considerate of my bare neighbors. <laughs> Even though they sometimes call the police on me when I'm doing ASMR. <laughs> mm, we're here? I thought this was like actual Minecraft music for a second. I kind of want to listen to Minecraft music. Um... But they never... It never plays. Is the problem. <laughs> it never plays. Mm. <laughs> yeah, need infinite music mon. Music playlist? I'm still like... It should be fine to do such a thing. I've done that before, right? But I still get kind of scared. Oh boy. I can't wait to go to sleep in my bed at my house. I can't wait. My comfy bed in my house.
Where's my bed? Where's my bed? My bed! My comfy bed! In my house! I was so excited to go to sleep! How could this happen? How could this happen? Could you tell that I saw? I saw, I witnessed the crime happen. <laughs> I saw it happen. <laughs> now the music is too quiet. Can I play Minecraft music? I mean, it's Minecraft, right? <laughs> I did before. It's Minecraft. Hold on. Minecraft from the Thursday. Mm. Is this Minecraft music? It's kind of sad, though. I've been listening to it lately, though, because I've been... Okay. Okay, okay, hold on. Because I like playing it on my kalimba. But I'm not allowed to do that, I don't think. <laughs> I don't know! Can I do it in a Minecraft stream? If I'm playing Minecraft? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's enough, that's enough. Wait, man, it's too loud. I'm getting louder. Minecraft. That <laughs> Bobo are gonna give me for real? I didn't commit any crimes. Okay, so... <laughs> I have so much stuff in my inventory from the Wither fight... ...that I don't need. Should I just dump it all in the same but one box? I think so. Who needs organization? At least I have good food now. I'm... Am I gonna remember this here? I don't have, um... Music con continues to get louder, hold on. <laughs> it's growing. I'm gonna forget this is in here for sure. <laughs> I'll remember. I don't need... Do I need all of this stuff? I don't know. I don't know, I'm just building a tree... ...is all. I got... ...this shulker. <gasps> I think I... There's another... I think I have... <laughs> I left my other shulker. I filled it with... ...with junk and left it. In the other server. But I definitely need two shulkers to build this tree. Mm. I don't have one here! <gasps> I thought I had one in here still. Oh. I kind of want to like go get new shulkers. But I don't know. <laughs> That's like a lot of work. Ouch. Maybe I can request some. I was like, wait, did someone leave me a new sign? <laughs> Welcome to Fauna's house! <gasps> a new message! Shulker farm? I don't know. I don't know if that's necessary. Uh, I can just go get some. I guess. I, mean, I should, right? 
need the space. I'll go, I'll go. My farms are fun though, but... I mean, I agree with you, making farms is fun, but... I have a tree to build, you know? Like, look how beautiful this server is. And then think about my tree. An unfinished blight looming in the distance. <laughs> I want to make it better. I wish I made it more curvy. Gave it more of an hourglass figure. I mean, it's not like too late. Necessarily. We can fix it. But... Mm, I will work on making another branch today so that it is no longer... Meow! Alright, you know what? Let's organize! You guys like organization, right? Let's be good. I'll put... Why do I have so many birch boats? I was really tempted to just dump everything in the shulker. Just in a random chest, but... I'm feeling gracious today. I will not hurt you like that. So let's organize it. What are you? Spruce? Spruce? Smooth stone? Um, 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 um. Iron... Goes... Here? Have, like, none? <laughs> it's okay, I have a very successful iron farm. Hostile mob blocks. I have plenty of bone meal already. Kelp lily pad. Goes in here. Wait, do I have organic items? Oh, I do. Goes in here. You go there? Oh, it'll be... <gasps> Ooh, I do want to like decorate the water too around the tree Like put like glowing corals in it and like lily pads and stuff Sea lanterns And I have a bunch of milk <laughs> I guess that goes in friendly mob drops <laughs> I don't know where else to put it Boop boop Dirt Goes in here, and then I have... Job blocks. Goes in there. Beautiful. Clean shulker. I kind of don't like the purple shulker. Like, I like purple. But it's just because it's the default one, you know? <laughs> um... Why do I not have any, like, blue? No blue dye. I guess this is blue. I don't have any green dye though, right? Can I make cyan? That's not how you make cyan. <laughs> how do I make cyan? That's how you make... This is what be how you make green. <laughs> Light blue. Green? Green plus blue, maybe, for cyan? I promise you I know my... how colors work. <laughs> oh, this is Minecraft banger. Okay. I just don't want it to be purple. I'm sorry. Purple is a nice color. It's one of my favorite colors. I'm wearing purple right now. My ribbon is purple. But the purple shulker, I don't know. Is it just me? I don't like it just because it's like... It's like the default. It feels... Unfinished. Incomplete. 
Oh, it's night time. Let's go to sleep. The default's awful. It's not the nicest shade of purple. It could be a better shade of purple. A more vibrant shade or a more pastel shade. Or even a more saturated... It's like a dull purple. There's... Magenta, right? You could make it magenta. Okay, is this all I need? I guess so. Oh, I love Minecraft music. I've been listening to it lately. <laughs> Just on my own. Listen to Minecraft music and feel nostalgic for bygone times. Cry a little bit. <laughs> Anybody else? Why is it always nighttime? It's like I'm flying around the world. I'm chasing the moon. Sploosh. Lo-fi hip-hop beats to study slash cry to. We've all been there. Study crying? That's a pretty bad place to be. <laughs> We've all been there though, right? Like when you have an exam and it's just hard and you don't want to study. And you know, or at least you feel like you're going to do bad and you're just having a bad day. But you have to study anyway. You're just sitting there like, why? Why do I have to do this? That's a creeper. <laughs> Getting too real. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. To ding up these. Is this what the Minecraft OST does? To an mf -er. Listens to Sweden once. <laughs> Suddenly remembers every sad thing that's ever happened. Okay. Let's chop trees. <laughs> what C14 does to an mf -er. It's true. But I don't know. Okay, I was on... I was listening to Minecraft music. I was in the comments section. And let me tell you... There were some... Zoomers in the comment section. I did not feel... I went to the comment section to like seek validation, you know? <laughs> People who are like me and I did not find it there. I was like, oh no. I do not... I cannot relate. <laughs> cannot relate. <laughs> Mission failed. I know. I thought... I thought... I thought I would go and be like... Look at the comments and be like, Ah, yes, I remember playing Minecraft when I was in middle school. <laughs> but the comments were like, I'm in middle school. <laughs> literally. Literally. <laughs> not, not, oh, I remember back in the good old days when life was simpler. It was... I'm in middle school, and I don't know, I'm about to graduate middle school and go to high school, and I'm scared for what life has in store for me, but at least the Minecraft OST is here for me. <laughs> it was, I was scrolling for a while in the comments. I really wanted some comment validation, and I did not find it. I was scrolling. They, it was one after another. It was, I'm 14 and this song makes me so nostalgic. <laughs> Which I was surprised by. I don't know. I don't want to hate on Zoomers. Because... I mean, they are our future. And like, sure. I feel... Crusty and dusty and old. But that's a me problem. That's not a them problem. They didn't do anything wrong just because they were born after the year 2000. Just because they were born in 2010 and now they're posting on the internet. 
that's allowed. But I was surprised that they too feel nostalgic for the Minecraft OST. I don't know. I didn't realize that the Minecraft OST has such power. Even if you didn't play Minecraft in beta back in the day, you still feel emo when you listen to it. Nostalgic for a simpler time. Although, man, these middle schoolers. <laughs> well, I should know, I shouldn't say that. Middle school is hard. I was gonna say, like, they don't know what's... what's coming. <laughs> they don't have a taste of it yet. But honestly, I think middle school is, like, one of the hardest times... for people, like, in general. Middle school? I don't think it's easy. Sure, your life is simple. You know, you don't have adult responsibilities, but... It's hard. Yeah, high school, too. It's hard. <laughs> I think... My life has gotten... I don't know. Like, yeah, I have to pay taxes and whatever. I have to make my own doctor's appointments, but... My life is... Probably simpler. I mean, it's not... I don't know. I mean, like, my life's kind of crazy right now. <laughs> Just because of this. But at least I... Am not... In high school. <laughs> That's hard. That's hard. It's hard to be a teenager, right? You've got all these... These feelings. You're emo. You have to worry about fitting in at school. Or not fitting in at school. can be some of that as an adult too, but hopefully, hopefully, you can be more confident in yourself, in the people that you associate with. You don't have to, well, hopefully, hopefully, <laughs> ideally, you don't have to worry so much about fitting in, because it doesn't matter if you fit in, as long as you have people you care about. Yeah, but they say, you know, high school never ends. <laughs> but I don't know, I feel like that's also has to do with who you hang out with. Although you don't always get a choice in that matter. I live a pretty drama-free life. <laughs> I'm just chilling. But not everyone can be so lucky. Yeah, you left high school and never looked back. Me too. Like, when I was in high school... I don't know. I didn't, like... Realize... Until I got older. Like, I thought that I had a pretty good high school experience. And I think I did overall. It was not bad. But I still look back and I'm like... Man, I was, like, really... Just, like, sad. <laughs> For what? Like, why? I think it's just... It's just a hard time... In your life. I didn't even, like, realize it until I got older... And became, like, more happy... And more confident in myself, and I was like, oh, man... <laughs> that kinda... That kinda sucked. Yeah, it's like... I mean, teenage hormones are real, right? Messes with your brain chemistry. Gives you the sad. So I don't know. To all the, the zoomers in the comments section of the Minecraft OST. I mean, people always say that. This right? Like, adults always say this. They say, like, hang in there. It gets better. I really do think that. I don't know. I don't really know anyone who's like, oh yeah, high school? That was... <laughs> that was awesome. 
Best time of my life. That's what, like, the movies tell you, but... I don't know. I don't think so. <laughs> there is a lot left... ...in life... ...beyond high school. I think some people... ...they, like, turn 18 and they feel like their life is over. They feel like they're old already. I mean, you see this too. <laughs> you see people on the internet being like, Oh... I turned 18, I'm so old now. It's like, what? <laughs> you have your whole life ahead of you. Once you turn 18, that's when you can finally even like start making decisions for yourself. You can take control over your life more. You're only old after 25? Please, please! I am four and a half billion, and I don't think I'm old yet. I've still got plenty of... life left in me. <laughs> I'm still kicking. Oh no. I mean, there's no use in being like, oh, I'm too old to do this anyway, right? Like, as long as you're still alive. Then you can try, at least. It doesn't hurt to try. If you think you don't have time to, like, go back to school or anything. Like, what's the other option? It's just that you don't, and then maybe you don't pursue your goals. But even if... <laughs> even if... Even if, let's say... You're, like, 90 years old. And you're like, oh man, I don't like my job. I didn't bring a bed. That's fine. <laughs> What's happening here? Sorry. <laughs> Flashing? You're 90 years old. I guess hopefully you'd be retired. But <laughs> uh, well, let's say you are retired then. You're 90 years old. You're retired. But you hate being retired. And you wish that you could go... Let's say you want to be like a dog groomer. You love dogs. And you want to be a dog groomer. But you think, oh, I'm too old. I'm... It's my, the end of my life. I don't have it in me. Don't have enough time left. I mean, you could just not become a dog groomer and then just... You know, live the rest of your life not doing that. And being somewhat upset about it. Or... You could say, who cares? I'll just do it anyway. And then you go get your... Dog grooming certification. And then you have... <laughs> even if it's just a little bit of time... To do what you want to do. It's still better than not doing it, right? You might as well. Oh, oh. YOLO, you know? <laughs> Oddly specific. I don't know. Do you ever watch those dog grooming videos on YouTube? Sometimes I feel like they're... I know they're probably not too aggressive with the dogs, but sometimes it feels I'm like, oh, Be gentle, be gentle. Sometimes it feels like they... are really... going at it with the dogs. <laughs> And then there's the ones where they, like, dye their... ...fur. And, like, shape it. <laughs> Do we all live the same life? I assume that you asked that because you're like... <laughs> Wait, we watch the same videos on YouTube. But sounding oddly philosophical... <laughs> We're all human, or Kirin, or tree. We all live in the confines of the earth. We all live to see... the same era. Except for me, I've seen so many eras. <laughs> We're all right here. 
on the internet. Could say there's a lot of similarities in the ways that we live. In the human experience. Compared to an alien, it might seem like we all live the same lives. But I think most people don't feel that way. Like we live the same lives. Oh, ouch. It's very dark. <laughs> this is so deep. Maybe we can... We can go get the... Minecraft Zoomers who commented on the... Minecraft OST videos to comment on this one. I'm 14 and this is deep. <laughs> it's not really! I'm just rambling about whatever while I'm trying to chop down these logs. <laughs> Get in the comments! Don't actually, I will feel so old. Not that that's a bad thing. No matter what people try to tell you. There's nothing wrong with the being old or getting older. I don't think I'm old even. <laughs> it beats the alternative. In my opinion. <laughs> Which is, you know, just dying. I would rather get older. Yeah. And I hope that you would too. I hope so. I hope so. And if you don't, I hope you can come to a point where you do. You never know what the future has in store. Benjamin Button? Let me think, okay. Is Benjamin Button... Which has more suffering? Benjamin Button or like the normal human? Life experience. Mm. <laughs> like, imagine we were all like Benjamin Button, and that's like the default. It it is. It would be very terrifying. Like, <laughs> would you would you start like losing your mental faculties slowly? You know. Like, probably until you hit, like, the age of... You know, like... Well, they say your brain fully matures when you're, like, 25. So probably until you hit 25, it's, like, awesome. Like, you feel better every day. You know? As you're getting younger, you feel stronger. But once you hit 25... <laughs> you're like, oh no... <laughs> Then your brain starts regressing, you become more immature every day. <laughs> and eventually, like, you reach a point where you, like, stop understanding things. Like, you stop <laughs> having an adult's mind over the world. I don't know, like, I'm, and then you have to go through puberty again, too. <laughs> Do you, like, reverse puberty? <laughs> and then you come out the other end, like... A child. The mind of a child. I guess that could be fun, you know. Have childlike wonder again and imagination. But then... It's like every day you understand less and less. And it, the world becomes more and more mysterious to you. And then when you hit like three years old... <laughs> that's when it all... It's, it starts going, you know? It does sound like a nightmare. <laughs> I-I th I think it's better... Not to be Benjamin Button. So we should be thankful. Be thankful you're getting older. <laughs> it beats the reverse, right? <laughs> I 
How do families work if the... If humans... Reverse in age? Who, like, takes care of you? Your child? <laughs> I don't know. Cat? Your cat takes care of you? Yeah, it, maybe it is best not to think about it. <laughs> Let's just be thankful. That that's not how the mind works. How humans work. I didn't fill up my inventory. All these spruces. Epic <laughs> peachy, I know. This is what the Minecraft OST does. It makes you talk about it. <laughs> the strangest things. Maybe not the strangest. We've probably had stranger... Stranger things. Haha. -ha. TV show. <laughs> I love that show. I liked the first season a lot. And then... I didn't really... I was watching the most recent season. I heard it's... Alright. I heard there's some good stuff there. I don't know, I feel like every TV show has the same problem though. And it's like... Because they... Each... Well, I guess Stranger Things probably was originally meant to just be one season, right? Every show that was meant to be one season at first has this problem, I feel like. The first season is like a great self-contained story. But then because it's a great self-contained story, people are like, I want more. So they're like, okay, we'll do more. But each season, the, like, scope gets bigger and bigger. But when you, like, keep expanding the scope... Eventually, it just sort of, like... It becomes too big. And just, like, doesn't fit in with what the original show was about anymore. It's like, you have to end up, like, fighting God by the end. And like, that's... <laughs> that's just too much. But people maybe won't be satisfied if like... If the scope stays the same. Because then it will feel like monster of the week, you know? Like monster of the season. I feel like the real solution is like... It has to be... Like, planned to be... A long series from the beginning, so it can have a consistent story arc that makes sense. Or they just have to stop renewing it for more seasons every time. I'm sure it can work when you get bigger in season or bigger in scope every season. I'm thinking of like Breaking Bad. Breaking Bad, like. The, s the scope does change. It doesn't change like that much, though. Not as much as like some more fantasy shows. Everything's so like grounded in the setting, you know? But you know, Walter White is dealing with more powerful people. Sort of. Sort of. It's sort of like crescendos, and then... Yeah. I don't want to spoil it. <laughs> but I think Breaking Bad, like... Is a good example of a show... That does not just, like... <laughs> lose track of what it is, and... Sort of... 
become worse each season. <laughs> I think you, you, a lot of people say it even gets better each season. Did I finish Better Call Saul? No! It's not on Netflix. The final season is not on Netflix. I don't know where to watch it. Mm. <laughs> it is now? Wait, it is? I thought it was coming out in like the fall. It is? Oh, I can finish it. <laughs> Wait, really? I thought it was coming to Netflix in like September or August. <gasps> It just came out. <laughs> yeah, time to watch. Oh. Have I watched Succession? No, but um, I watched it. One of my family members is a lawyer. <laughs> and she recommended she was like real it was at thanksgiving this family member she was really selling everybody what's thanksgiving wait did i even visit my family for thanksgiving i don't remember <laughs> or christmas christmas maybe she was really selling uh succession to the whole family and so i watched an episode on the plane when i went to japan <laughs> Because they had it. Well, I watched a lot of stuff on the plane in Japan. But I don't know. I didn't... I don't know. <laughs> I have no strong feelings about that show. It was like... They were saying like the F word a whole lot. <laughs> That's like my, my opinion. That's my review of the show. <laughs> like they said the F word like a whole lot. There you go. <laughs> the fauna word? No, the... The frick word. But not that one. <laughs> they were saying sw It was like a lot. It was like... I don't know. <laughs> it was a lot of swearing. Also, I was on the plane. It hadn't been many hours. And I was pretty tired, so... <laughs> I don't know. It was, like, entertaining. For, like, the hour that I watched it. I don't really remember <laughs> any of it. <laughs> Ow. Sorry if your favorite show is Succession. like a seven for you yeah seven's not bad though you know like a seven is entertaining enough really for you to sit there and watch it especially if you're trapped in a <laughs> in a machine in the sky for many hours seen the boys no but i remember everyone's talking about it on like Amazon Prime. <laughs> it's nine out of ten on Steam. Well, I think seven is good. We've talked about this. Seven is good if it's like an objective rating, which it never is. To me, a seven out of ten should be like enjoyable to watch. But like Steam reviews, all reviews are inflated. So that a 7 out of 10 is actually not. <laughs> it's actually... I feel like a 7 out of 10 is more like a 5 out of 10. Because the reviews are... So inflated. Yeah, exactly! 6 out of 10 should be above average. I agree. So 7 out of 10 should be good. Like, solidly good. 
It's like not... Amazing. But it's good. <laughs> I think it's because 7 out of 10... Like a 70? It's like a C minus. <laughs> Which is perhaps not good. It's passing. I suppose. <laughs> School ruined it? Yeah. What I mean, really? It's like... I don't know. If you grade on a curve... I mean, every school does it, like, differently. I feel like usually when schools grade on a curve... The middle of the curve... Is more like an 80. Or even like an 85. It's like half the people... Get a B or an A. But... I don't know. If it's a C... That is... I don't know. <laughs> if it's a C, then half the people are getting like a C or a D or failing. But grading on a curve doesn't make... I mean, it does make sense because it's hard to write a test... ...that's fair, you know? I mean, you can say it and just get good, write a better test. <laughs> but it is hard, I think. But like, what if everyone in class... ...does amazing on the exam? Then everyone should get an A. You shouldn't have to gr you shouldn't have to scale it <laughs> or curve it. But usually curves are supposed to be in the student's favor. So it's more like, oh, the highest score on this exam was actually an 82. But that person will get an A plus because they got the highest score in the class. Did you ever think about like what if the whole class <laughs> conspired? Together? This probably wouldn't work. But imagine if the whole class decides to conspire together and like, okay, we're all gonna bomb the exam. <laughs> so then they'll curve it. And we'll all do well. But then if it just takes one person <laughs> to take it seriously. <laughs> Always one guy. I mean, honestly, like I probably would have been the one guy. Like, I... I would be way too scared to risk... <laughs> to, like, purposefully fail an exam. I'm not gonna risk that. Put my faith in everyone else that they're also... going to risk it? I don't know. you hear this? Is it the Minecraft soundtrack? <laughs> it's like... Yeah, it's like water dripping. Is this normal? <laughs> the prisoner's dilemma? I mean, if it's the prisoner's dilemma, then I'm definitely going to choose... What are the options again? Help... <laughs> help or hurt? <laughs> or steal the money or don't steal? I don't remember. What is it? Trust or betray? Ally or betray? It's virtue's last reward. I will definitely choose... Trust. Although, I guess the exam thing is just, like, the prisoner's dilemma, but... <laughs> but more... <laughs> more people. But also, like, real... is real life. And we're not prisoners, we're students, and you can just study... ...if you want to get good. <laughs> just study! But if it's like... I'm not gonna just betray someone. Especially...
Especially if I am a prisoner, if I committed a crime. <laughs> Maybe I deserve to go to jail in that case. <laughs> Students equal prisoners. Maybe high schoolers, when you... When you have no choice but to go to school. But if you're like choosing... If you're like paying to go to college... You're not a prisoner, right? <laughs> you may feel like it. But you're paying for that experience. <laughs> you're paying for the suffering. Prisoner of debt? Now that is... That's true. <laughs> Certainly. Mm -hmm. Prisoners of social expectations? Aren't we all? Prisoners to society? Aren't we all? <laughs> Can I collect some more saplings? The music's getting spooky. I picked the overworld tracks. Okay. <laughs> Prisoner of the internet? No, no, no. I... It's not, I'm not addicted. It's not an addiction. I can stop anytime. Okay. We got stuff. Plenty of stuff. I do want... A bed. Let's go check on my animals. I think some of them escaped. Oh, because the creeper blew up. Are any of them still here? Okay, we got one alpaca and three sheep. Okay. Um... It's fine. They, they will just be free. It's not like they're dead, necessarily. They might just be free. In nature. <laughs> yes, thank you, Ina, for saving them. Thank you, thank you. I owe you everything. Okay. The music's quite mysterious for this tree. I kind of like it. It's giving me like magical forest vibes. Is this one of the new tracks or something? Mm. Not new? Oh. Oh, it's a creative mode. <laughs> Wait, am I allowed to listen to that? I don't know. <laughs> That's why I don't know it. <laughs> it's good. Getting banned. Unarchived Minecraft stream. <laughs> oh yeah, if you didn't see my ASMR from yesterday or this morning. <laughs> Uh, the VOD is back. It's, it'll be in the video tab. Because I had to re-upload it. I just cut out some... Sirens, so it does not interrupt the ASMR experience. Not the video tab. I know. It's not a video, but I, it can be in the video tab for now. It's fine. Because it's... I just got annoyed when it was like... Resident Evil 7 Part 4. Like randomly in the video tab. 
But ASMR, there's already ASMR videos in the video tab, so it can stay there for now. Maybe one day I will unlist it. But for now, <laughs> it can stay. So... So... I'm thinking... I do want to build... Like, up and out. So we can have a better shape. But I'm thinking maybe for balance purposes... I need to do another branch over on... Over here. Mm. I don't know if it will look weird if it's exactly opposite of this one. I feel like it won't. Because you won't really be viewing them at the same time. Unless you're standing over there. Or over there, I guess. <laughs> yeah, it can be at different height. But I feel like I need to put another one at this height on this side. Because I was thinking of going up. And then putting more branches further up. Because... But I feel like for balance... It look weird if the lower branches are both on the same side. Is it gonna be much taller? I feel like it needs to be a bit taller. I don't know. I'm kind of unhappy with the shape. The like hourglass shape of it right now. Hmm. <laughs> the non hourglass shape, but it's. I don't know. <laughs> what can I do except for. Keep going. Um. So, if we build a branch, it's too small. You see what I'm doing? Like this guide. I feel like these are the sides, and then this is the top. And the bottom will be like down here. Uh, I don't know if it's too small of a branch. Start it lower. I don't want it to go too much lower than this because it's just going to make it look, look even less shapely. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh my god. Have you considered extending a branch over Castle Croning causing increased creeper spawns from the shade? Great idea. <laughs> Excellent idea. Mm. It needs to go out and up. This is fine. This might be kind of a small branch, though. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. This happens every time I build a branch. <laughs> Actually, every time. I changed the slope. Oops. 
Oops. How long? To make a branch? <laughs> um, I feel like I need a place to view it from over here. I could just fly and hope I don't die. <laughs> Try to sneak a glance of it at it from the air. Oh, that looks weird. <laughs> it looks weird. It looks too symmetrical. Yeah, it shouldn't be at the same height. But I feel like I messed up putting these two like at the similar height. Oh, T posing. Oh no. And I already placed so many blocks. Can I get them back? No! No! Dang it. That's okay. I got plenty of spruce. <laughs> Ooh! Ah! Bop, 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 bop. I hate this thing. I hate scaffolding. <laughs> Why can I never climb scaffolding? Gah. I good. Gah. Gah. <laughs> Many Minecraft noises. Mm. Okay. Man. I don't know what to do with this tree. <laughs> I want the shape to be better. Please. Give me. Give me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know about the shape. I don't know. Maybe I will build the height up a little bit. And see how it looks. I feel like I'm playing Skyblock right now. <laughs> With your dig, you could try to reclaim. But it just falls into the void. What's this too? It's just a dirt bridge, but... <laughs> I don't know why it looks cool. It's like evidence of life. Of civilization. Someone has been here. Server is changing all around us. Night time? Bedtime? No! I knew you were gonna do that! Oh. We didn't even go! <sighs> I knew you were gonna do that. I should've landed in the boat. <laughs> the boat clutch? That would've been impressive, right? How's my electric? Should be good. I fixed everything recently. Although my axe is already... ...getting worn down. From all the spruce mining. The dream boat clutch. I remember watching... I've watched like one... Dream manhunt. And it felt... I don't know. Should I, wait, can I say this? Am I gonna get in trouble? I mean... It felt so... Scripted to me. I think they are scripted, right? They have to be. No! <laughs> I'm not saying that there's anything wrong with them being scripted either. Oh, I need to finish this branch too. Feels like there's 
is no way that this is not scripted. <laughs> Like, how come Dream is the only one... ...who... <laughs> ...who knows how to do a boat clutch? You know? Like, how come no one else can figure that out? When it's like... ...part 25... ...of... ...Manhunt. Does he ever lose? Does Dream ever lose the Manhunt? He should, right? Oh, he does multiple times. That's good. <laughs> I feel like it's more... I don't know. In my opinion, it's more fun if it's not scripted. I want to see like a bunch of... people who are great at Minecraft. Like, try their hardest. <laughs> Be super sweaty. And the Minecraft manhunt, you know? Why can't we have that? Wouldn't that be fun? Some good old competition? <laughs> there are manhunts like that on YouTube? Yeah, I'm sure there are. I should set up a hollow live version. That'd be fun. <laughs> I'm if I'm like being the one who's hunted though, I I need to get better at speedrunning first. My best speedrun time is like three hours. <laughs> we can't have a three hour speedrun. But I don't know, I feel like manhunts... Do they even work? Well, I guess... You can like, um... Like, what if you just dig a hole and hide? I guess that's like, not in the spirit of the manhunt, you know? So you shouldn't do that? Like, why don't... Why doesn't Dream just like... Lose them? Oh, they have a compass? Oh... Don't they do that all the time? I don't know. I probably shouldn't talk about it because I have only watched like one one episode. Maybe only like five minutes of one episode. <laughs> Why don't they do this thing that they already absolutely do? Oh. I just saw him, like, jump off a cliff in, like, boat clutch and then, like, everyone who was hunting him also, like, jumped off the cliff after him, but they didn't have boats, so they just died. And, like, that's the part I'm confused about. Because they know, right? They, they know that they don't have boats or water bucket, that, like, they're gonna, they're gonna die if they jump off the cliff? I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, that's the part I, that feels very scripted. But wouldn't it be more interesting if they do, instead of like jumping down, they bridge across or build a quick water bucket? <laughs> or if they learn to boat clutch too? I'm sure they do, right? Probably, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know anything. <laughs> oh wait, now I'm remembering... How much trouble I was having with this branch. They said they redo manhunts until they get good ones. See, but I feel like... They should all be good, right? Like, it's, it's a fun concept in and of itself. Right? <laughs> they don't, they don't have to, like... I don't know. Like, what would be a bad manhunt? I guess when you have... Like, that many subscribers, like, the stakes are... They're so high. The expectations are so high. Yeah, maybe people will be disappointed. 
if it's not the like, oh my god. Boat clutch. <laughs> What is this branch? What have I done? Do I have my glowstone? Only eight! Oh no, I should have got more at the farm. Do I even have torches? No. Why would I have torches? I don't need that. <laughs> That's fine. Mm. But anyway, I'm not trying to be a hater. <laughs> I should be... I should be careful. I do hate this branch though. Why is it like this? What have I done? What have I created? No, <laughs> keep cooking. It's not a drama channel. I'm not here to start drama. That's like my problem because I just like talk about things <laughs> as if I'm nobody because I am nobody and no one should care what I think but maybe there are people who care <laughs> even though no one should care it doesn't matter what I think about the famous Minecraft YouTubers <laughs> Mm. Next dream is gonna say my <laughs> world tree is ugly. <laughs> he should say that. That would be good. Maybe then I will become a drama channel. <laughs> that would be exciting. Some exciting drama. He has enough drama. I do not keep up anymore. I did see his face reveal. And he's just like... He's like literally a guy. <laughs> and everyone... I don't know. I don't know. It's just weird. It's just weird. He's literally just a guy. <laughs> and everybody is like... I don't know. <laughs> everybody has to say something about it. I guess even I'm saying something about it. But it's like... It's, it's not that big of a deal, right? Either way, it's just... He's just a... Just a dude. <laughs> They hating people were hating. <laughs> people were really hating. <laughs> it's kind of scary. <laughs> like I don't know. Imagine like if you just look like a normal dude and you get that much hate. Like, you- that wouldn't happen in real life, probably. I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, what are, what are you supposed to look like? I don't know. I don't know. It's weird. 
you're a hater. You shouldn't make fun of someone for their looks. You can critique them for maybe hiring. No, I shouldn't say that. <laughs> We're gonna get in trouble. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> no drama. No drama. <laughs> yeah, for their actions. For their actions. Mm -hmm. Spicy. I shouldn't be. I shouldn't be. Again, it's because I like... I'm... Literally just a guy. <laughs> People... I don't know. I f I'm... I'm not just talking... To nobody. But I feel like I am. <laughs> My opinions don't matter, so... Don't take anything I say seriously. <laughs> Ever. Ow. Mm. No, I don't want to fall. Please, no. <laughs> I hate scaffolding. If I have drama, I'm going to have with scaffolding. Have you guys watched that? Um... It's like a documentary series? What's it called? It's about... New York City... Is made... Was it made by Nathan Fielder or was it made by Nathan's, Nathan Fielder's friend? You guys know what I'm talking about? What is it called? How To with John Wilson. That's the one. Yeah, it's like produced by Nathan Fielder. But the, it is! There's an episode about scaffolding. <laughs> in it. And it gets like weirdly philosophical. What was the main takeaway about scaffolding? Didn't he go... There was like a scaff... Was there a scaffolding convention? I should rewatch it. I don't remember it that well. The scaffolding drama. Well, we shouldn't hate scaffolding. It's there to protect us, right? From like construction... Falling on our heads. That would be bad. We can all agree... That that would be bad, right? <laughs> this is getting a little chaotic, this tree. Mm. Where's the fun in that? That's true. Do you ever just want it to be a little bit like Donkey Kong? When you go outside... Into the real world... I've been saying that our streets are too safe... <laughs> we could use some... You know... Gorillas throwing barrels at us while we're just trying to walk to work... Make things more exciting... Jumping over fire? Yeah! We could use the excitement. Maybe like some bananas you could slip on. Just here and there. <laughs> Not enough spike pits around. Yeah, and why don't we get rid of manhole covers while we're at it? Like, why cover it up? And you could just have a portal to the sewers. That's where all the excitement of a city is anyway, right? That's where you find the... Sewer gators. All kinds of excitement. <laughs> 
looks... It looks... It looks not that good. But maybe it doesn't really matter how it looks up close. We can dream. Mm. Is it fully enclosed at least? Yeah, it is all about the big picture. E. <laughs> I, I want to stop saying E. I don't want E to become a thing. I feel like it's not as cute as ooh. <laughs> The owl! The headless owl. Okay, still looks like a slug. Mm-hmm. Change mm -hmm. <laughs> the emo no. No. I want to, like, work on just one side of the tree. And then do the other side. I don't know if that's... <laughs> that's a bad idea, though. It's just because that gives more instant gratification. Like, this part... I want to go up... And then out a bit. That's true, it is motivation. Whatever works. And then we can have a good template for the other side. Maybe. And then, yeah, what if it goes out one? Is it annoying that the wood grain is facing the different direction? Maybe? But you know... It's fine. <laughs> we call it texture. Around here. I'm gonna have to texture like the whole tree. The music's getting spooky. Should we go back to Animal Crossing? I feel like this music is leading us down the wrong... The wrong path. Not the kind of person I want to be. First, I'm being too needlessly deep. And then I'm starting drama. <laughs> I feel the need to apologize already. <laughs> I don't want to be a drama tuber. No, no drama queen. The twist longer. No, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna have to drop my apology video. <laughs> and then, and then I'm gonna be on all the. The drama channels, they're gonna rank my apology video. It's gonna go in the YouTuber apology tier lists. And the title announcement. I wouldn't do that to you. Well, I shouldn't say that though, because then if I ever do like make it a <laughs> title announcement, then you know that it's bad. Hmm. <laughs> I'll try to be clear in the title. It'll be called like apology video. <laughs> It'll just be called I'm sorry. Good night. Apology.mp4 and it's like the default thumbnail. Just taken from the video, not even a custom thumbnail. I gotta work on my crying face, though. <laughs> uh, 
I can't... I can't even cry right now. Things have been going on. Maybe you've noticed with other members, we're all a little bit scuffed right now, I think. I can't cry right now. <laughs> I can't be sad right now. <laughs> But I can be happy, and that's all I need to be. <laughs> mm. What am I doing? I'm just walking around and talking. Classic Minecraft experience. Um. I do want the trunk to go out. I don't know how like far up... ...and far out it needs to go. <laughs> Far out, man. Mm. I want to go look at it. Again. What's this like this? Don't be like this. Be less. Okay, I don't think it should go... Out super fast. It is now going out. She's making progress. I think it's bigger like every time I look at it. This is just the gate, right? Castle gate. I hope the castle's really big in there. What if we just make a bunch of mega builds? <laughs> big owl. Big castle. Big tree. That's prison? It's a castle. Maybe I should try to m make my house down there look more medieval. So it fits in. Then it looks like Crony like, lives in the castle and I live in the medieval peasant house. That'd be cute. I really like the brick um, road that they have over there by the guild too. It looks very nice. Oh no! I fell. I didn't even fall that far. Oh, was Ollie the one who did the roads? They look really good. I kind of want to copy it and build them like over there. By my little house. Okay, I'm gonna go look at it. I think I need to blend the top of the branch in with the tree as well. Oh, uh oh. Gotta land somewhere. <laughs> um. Okay, it looks a little weird. A little. <laughs> I think I need to continue this part too Or else it will look weird Hmm I don't send why Don't just send a why I'm gonna fix it It's not gonna be a slingshot It's not gonna be a why it's not going to be a slug. It won't be anything. I regret this. You... Be gone? Oh wait, I don't know. Okay. 
now we're back to Minecraft OST that I recognize. Ooh. Turn it up. <laughs> it's a classic for sure. I'm 14 and this is nostalgic. I know how that feels. Or how it sounds. People say that. But 14 year olds are allowed to be nostalgic too. They can be nostalgic for things that happened in the last 14 years, I guess. <laughs> mm. This is sort of like blended in. Maybe. May need to replace these so they look better. They are babies still, it's true. But they can be nostalgic. Minecraft music makes anybody feel nostalgic, apparently. Even if you are still a baby. Mm. That's the power. I do kind of want to switch back to Animal Crossing. <laughs> Not real Animal Crossing. Fake Animal Crossing. Oh, this one is really good too, though. Do it? Okay, I will. After this one. The Minecraft OST is turning me too combative. But <laughs> that's not how it should turn you. <laughs> I think that might be personal problem. Wait, this is wrong. Oh gosh, what have I done? This is all wrong. The side. It shouldn't be like this. Fix it. This is not a nice curve. Needs to be. Not here. Doesn't need to blend at the top. Ooh. <laughs> I'm just undoing everything that I've done. It's like here. This is like where my tree is. Oh, oh. Imagine how many spruce blocks I'm wasting by doing this. Oh. But also... It goes out one. As well. <laughs> At some point. I mean, it doesn't have to go out like all... At the same... Elevation, anyway. It's probably better if it doesn't, so it can be more... Natural. And then this wall here... Get out of here. Go. Be gone. It's the night time again. Hold on. Changing the music. Is 
this quiet? Oh no, I'm gonna be fiddling with the volume controls again. <laughs> Until it's perfectly exactly right. Light areas? What do you mean? It's plenty of light. <laughs> it's so well lit here. What do you mean? Just look at it. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. I feel like this is weird too. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna change it again. Cause really these branches, like this thing, should also kind of become a branch, if you know what I mean. Where do the leaves start? I'm gonna do the leaves at the very end. <gasps> Ouch. It will be a dead tree. First. <laughs> Should I look up for vector illustrations of trees? Will that help me? Hmm. Google trees. Okay. Tree. I'm looking. It looks nothing like the tree I'm building. <laughs> what have I done? How do I fix this? Okay. I'll fix it. So I think this part... Oh. Wait, I don't want, even want to be here. Um... I think... Oh gosh. What do I think? I feel like this part needs to become one... Like, giant... Branch. Like, the trunk needs to turn into a branch. Here. Because that's what happens with the many trees. Did I even sketch out what I wanted it to look like? Yes, I did! Was it a detailed sketch? No. Does it have to be? I don't think so. <laughs> May we see you saw it already. I didn't save it. It's out there somewhere. I streamed it. <laughs> you can find it. <laughs> you saved it? Thank you. Yeah, it's in my mind. I have it perfectly envisioned. I just... Why is this like this? Why is it shaped like this? <laughs> so the trunk eventually needs to split, you know? And I'm thinking maybe it splits now. So like, what if... It's like this. It's too big. So it's gonna be like a smaller circle. 
The trunk will be split. But how many should it be split into? Probably two or three. And I can just figure it out. <laughs> This side easier too, maybe. Ooh. Stop, stop, stop. I just want you to climb the scaffolds. <laughs> See, I can't I can't make fun of Dream because Dream would never be caught dead with such clumsy scaffolding skills. I will lose. In any metric, I lose. <laughs> the scaffolding clutch. Is that real? I guess it could be, right? If you like go up it, you don't take damage. I don't know. But I have an elytra equip equipped. You like shouldn't need to clutch if you've got an elytra on. <laughs> You should just be fine. There, it's like a big oval. But then this part is going to be weird. I don't know how this part's gonna work. Navigating the split? But I think it's fine. Oh no! Oh no! Again. I'm bad. Ow! <laughs> I'm just bad. I'm falling so fast! I'm at the bottom. I fell to the bottom. That's why I have Feather Falling 3, I guess. <laughs> this is a skill issue. My Minecraft skills are so rusty. It would be fun to do another speed run. I don't know if I have it in me to like actually get good as where I mean not even like good. I don't know if I have it in me to even get like a sub one hour speed run in this game. How my Mario Maker skills? I don't know. I'm gonna practice though. <laughs> my problem with Mario Maker, I feel like it has a delay. When you play with it with the capture card. I need to figure it out and make sure that I'm not playing with a delay. Because that will kill you in the platforming. Ball C. <laughs> yeah, well, I never figured out with the capture card. With the Elgato, <laughs> you can like they have the quote unquote instant replay or not replay the instant viewer whatever. Do you know what I'm talking about? Any any streamers in the chat? <laughs> um, it has the software which supposedly gives you like an instant viewer, but I don't think it's actually instant. I think it has a delay, right? A slight delay. But you can take the HDMI and output it directly to a monitor. But then that monitor will be for your capture card and or for your game and not for your Windows. You won't be able to put like your chat on it or anything. 
Is that right? Yeah, I do need a monitor splitter. I do need that. So I guess for... I mean, when I'm playing like Pokemon, it doesn't matter. <laughs> if it has a small delay. But I think for Mario Maker, it actually matters. Especially when I have teammates. <laughs> so I think I will... I will not be lazy and I will route the capture card to my monitor. Yeah. Splitter delay is also a thing. Okay, well, I don't have a splitter, so I just won't get one. I'll just change it. I'll practice. WWW. Ooh. <laughs> Yeah, I'll practice. I kind of want to try some really hard levels. I have no idea what the tournament is going to be like. I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know how hard it's going to be. But I want to... I don't know. I might... I might practice a lot. What if I practice a lot? What if I try to get really good? Very hard? I haven't played much Mario Maker before. I do love 2D Mario though. Do we know which... Um... Era of Mario? Wait, wait I guess you guys probably... I don't know. I probably would know more than you guys. But I don't know. <laughs> All of them? <laughs> yeah, you guys surprisingly know more than me a lot of the times, so. though. Mm. Oh. So this is weird, too. Because this part should get, like... It should move... As well. Like, the circle should go in one direction. Haha, <laughs> one direction. Yeah, it should tilt. Oh, I feel like the scale is all messed up. <laughs> on my tree, though. It's already Minecraft Monday. It's Minecraft Thursday. Oh, oh. Farm the wither and put a beacon inside the tree. I do want to fight the wither. I want my own beacon. That I can move with me if I need... Buffs. <laughs> Which I don't... I don't really... I mean, I have pretty good tools, but you know... <gasps> what? Did you see that? Oh no. Oh no. Here, let's just go look at it. <laughs> There's a hole in my tree. With the general shape of my tree. <laughs> I'm insecure about the shape of my tree. Every tree is beautiful. I just feel like it should be more like this. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway. <laughs> It's gonna split up here. Also, I feel like it's getting taller. No! Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know how to get up there. Scaffolding, probably. Actually, I can. I can just use this scaffolding. Build scaffolding challenge 2023 impossible. Will never be done. 
I ate a salad today with expired salad dressing. Because <laughs> it was the only salad dressing I had. And I was like, ooh, I'm going to add pasta. And I was like, I'll make a little side salad with my pasta. And then I put like the, the lettuce in my bowl. And then I was like, okay, now let's find some salad dressing in the fridge. But all my salad dressing was expired. It's just a recommendation. It tasted fine and it smelled fine. <laughs> but it was expired. I agree. I feel like dressings don't expire that fast. I challenge you to go. Actually, I challenge you to do this right now because I'm kind of curious. I want you to go to your fridge and take out your ketchup bottle and tell me the expiration date. Tell me if it's expired or not and how expired is it? No? <laughs> right now, yes, right now. Do it and tell me. I want to know. <laughs> mm. 2024? March 2020? Really? September 2022? 2020? 2020, 24, November 2024? December 2020? April 2022? <laughs> See? Some of you are eating expired ketchup! <laughs> October 2022? You can't even read the expiration date! <laughs> Cold, I am calling you out. Now you can't make fun of me. For eating my expired salad dressing. <laughs> well, you can say it is dairy-based, but it's not real dairy, so... Does that make it okay? <laughs> Oh shoot, I messed up. I don't need these. But we'll see, you know. <laughs> it tasted fine. It was only... Should I even tell you how expired it was? I don't know. It was only... Couple months expired. <laughs> like two months. It's not that bad. <laughs> it's fine. It's a salad dressing. It lasts forever. <laughs> Your ketchup was. Some of you are eating ketchup from 2022. I know you're... I know how you feel. You're like, oh... 2022, it was just yesterday. It's barely 2023. It's May. Soon. It is not just barely 2023 anymore. I know it feels like it was just January, but... It's almost May. And that's just the truth. Um... I think you should go like this. Yes. <laughs> I know, I can't handle it either. It feels like time passes so quickly. I don't know. I don't want time to pass so quickly. I don't want life to pass me by. Okay, I think this is good though. <laughs> it 
Oh, girl, need to slow down. She's speed running. I don't know. I try not to have too much existential dread. <laughs> not this, not this topic again. Because I really believe like there's no point in having existential dread because it doesn't help you. So it's better to just not. <laughs> Just live your life and be happy, you know? But one thing that does fill me with existential dread... Is like the... the idea... I don't know if it's like... Actually true or not... But it does sort of feel that way... Is that as you get older... Your perception of time changes... So that... It does feel... Time does seem to go by faster... Like, when you're a kid, a summer feels like an eternity. But as you get older, it feels like less and less time is passing. That one's real? I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. So, it, even though, like, based on numbers, you could say you're just, like, one-fourth of the way through your life. But in your time perception, maybe you're already, like, feels... You've perceived, like, half of your life already. That's pretty terrifying. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Sorry to drop this on you if you're just... <laughs> We're just playing Minecraft. about it because there's no point in worrying and life is beautiful and you get to experience many things in your life and just try to be happy however you can that's what's most important and every day is a gift and at least you're not benjamin button <laughs> oh, I'm really worried about this tree. Let's not worry about something else instead of our existential dread. Let's worry about the tree. I'm not sure about the way I'm doing this. Let's go look at it again. <laughs> Stop! Ouch. You violated the law. Oh gosh. <laughs> it looks weird. It looks too cylindrical. It should be less even. Because these are like really uneven. It's so... So cylindrical. Hmm. <laughs> Wait, now it looks like a statue. Praise the sun. No. Oh no. Oh no. How is this gonna work? Because eventually there's gonna be like leaves on it. I think this branch should split again. At some point. Maybe that will look good? <laughs> oh my gosh. I just wanted to be a tree. <laughs> it looks like a person! Oh no. Oh no. Hold on. I have to go to an idol meeting. I'll be right back. Do you want to watch Fawn Asleep? To forget about the existential dread of the world. It'll be okay. Everything will be okay. Fauna Asleep is here. <laughs> 
I'll be right back. My name is Ceres Fauna, from Halloween Council. So, can we just appreciate nature? It's kind of beautiful, though. Okay, V, we got the drip. Yeah, Asagi Mon, she's a pro. Perfect 10, cutie pie. Oh, whoa. I am a gaming Kieran. I'm so good. I told you, right? 1v1 me, sapling. Sawa is the perfect loop. It's like the perfect timing. <laughs> I know, because every time I get back, I hear I hear Bay. <laughs> Bay is always there to welcome me back. I finished my cup of tea. I'm almost out of logs. We have a little more in there. Oh goodness. <laughs> oh goodness. What have I done? Hmm. I think it needs to split again. different angle. If I only look at it from this angle, I'm gonna be like biased of where I built stuff. I mean... <laughs> okay, you can see the flaw in my plan. Now. <laughs> Watch out for creepers. She has so many torches around though. Why did the creepers bother her so? Maybe I should try to like fill this in and then do the split on this side too? What do we think? Hmm... Should I get more glowstone too? Mmm. Statue of Liberty. <laughs> Maybe I'll try to connect it here. Ho oh, ho ho. Maybe that will help me. Figure out what I'm doing. That's 
far. Why have I done this? This is gonna take so much... So much wood? Well... <laughs> it is kind of fun... To do this strategy though. When you build like this. I think creepers are gonna spawn like right here. <laughs> Probably, right? Do I have coal though? Yeah, I could use saplings, but... I don't know, that... Ouch. That method was kind of not working out for me. Lately. That caused the... The shape that it... <laughs> that it has. My shape insecurity. Do I even have coal? I have lava buckets. Ah, <gasps> coal! Can I make like just... 64? Okay, close enough. I probably want more than that, but I don't know. Um, I'll take it with me actually. I'll put it in... This one. Boop, boop. Okay. Lava will brighten up the tree very fast. Don't even joke about that. It's so tall. But many of you are even saying that it's not tall enough. Will you ever be satisfied? <laughs> okay. Don't need my sword. Axes are just as good anyway. Okay. I am, like, wasting so many logs just by, like, falling off and then having to build up again. I would say that it's, like, not ideal. <laughs> but... It is how it is. <laughs> we can get infinite trees. Even if I don't have cool... Explodey automatic tree farm. It's the reverse strategy now. Which is fun because it's the same but more dangerous. Because you can just jump right off. <laughs> and it kind of makes me dizzy. To build like this. <laughs> Ooh. I'm feeling... feeling upside down. This is not... I don't know. I, this is not ideal. <laughs> now it's awkward to close the gaps. Like this. This is fine. Just do it like this. And hope that it looks okay. Uh oh. Oh. So this part also has to be. It will be interesting. Cause it needs to like blend and then split. Oh gosh. <laughs> I do want to. Uh, it's. How do I. How? Maybe. 
Maybe. I guess it should get smaller as it goes up. Two, the split. Wait, does the split start all the way down here, though? Oh, I don't even know. <laughs> should the split start down here? Hmm... Could happen anywhere, yeah. Maybe I should build it up a little taller, though. <laughs> Banana split. It reminds me of Papa's Freezeria. <laughs> Ask my dad what he thinks. That's a good idea, actually. <laughs> I was... I was talking... to Mama Kieran. <laughs> and she was, like, asking me... This was on... uh, Tuesday? So I didn't stream, and she was like... What were you up to today? I thought you streamed today. Because <laughs> Papa Kieran told me that you streamed. And then, apparently, when Papa Kieran was like, Oh yeah, Fauna was streaming today. Mama Kieran was like, what? Are you stalking her? <laughs> but I wasn't even streaming, so I don't know. Apparently he wasn't. Wasn't stalking me. So who knows? Maybe Papa Kieran is watching. What do you think? Should I... Where should I split the tree? <laughs> mm. Classic dad behavior it is. <laughs> Oh gosh, I kind of regret only building the branches on this side now. Oh, oh. Almost walked off. Does it need to split into three? <laughs> How is this even gonna work? It's very mysterious. This tree. Will three be weird, though? <laughs> Just follow your heart. What if it looks bad? <laughs> a tree? A tree. What is a tree? Let me look. The picture I'm looking at of a tree has three splits on it. Actually, a lot of the trees I'm looking at have three splits on them. I think... I think I know. I think we do three splits. It's gonna be like one here, one here, and then one over here, but then this one, it's gonna like go out and then up. And then it might split again. Like, almost like a... A right angle. I think. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna build this... A little taller? First? Before the split? And then it might have to go out as well. <laughs> this part is so satisfying, and yet it uses so many logs. It's like the fastest way <laughs> to get rid of all of the logs that you 
mind. I don't know why I always call it mining when you're using an axe to chop down logs. I just feel like it's Minecraft, so everything is mining. I mine the leaves, I mine the logs, I mine the diamonds. It's all mine. Log craft? That's almost certainly in game, right? It's probably on like the Google Play Store. And you install it on your phone and it like mines bitcoins. <laughs> Not for you. For somebody else. <laughs> Even that's mining. I mine the bitcoins. My computer mines the bitcoins after I... I <laughs> download... Serana Skyrim mods from unscrupulous sources. <laughs> Just kidding. I wouldn't do that. You shouldn't do that either. Steam Workshop only, please. I don't actually know, actually. I don't know anything about the Steam Workshop. If it's vetted at all. <laughs> mm. I know. I feel like I'm... <laughs> too... I'm going a little too wild today. Is this just every Minecraft stream? When your brain is empty and you just... <laughs> talk about anything? Because it's Thursday? I should have done this on Monday? Is that what you're saying? Only Minecraft Mondays safe? So, the splits. <laughs> Let me think about the splits. So, so, I want, I want, I want the tree to look good. So, it's gonna go out a little bit. really like a long circle though okay well, that's a fine it doesn't have to take up that whole area <laughs> look for real tree pictures but i feel like it's hard because then you have to you have to figure out how to simplify the tree i'm looking at like an illustration because it's already simplified for me <laughs> i don't have to think about think about it i don't like how there's holes Oh, it looks kind of misty. I know it's like the render fog, but it looks kind of nice. Is it gonna be okay? Is my tree gonna be okay? Is it gonna be too big and you're not gonna be able to see anything? Oh, a zombie. Um... Why did they add zombies to Minecraft? I know they've like always been in the game. <laughs> they used to be really strong, right? They could, like, hit you from... They had, like, more range than you had. But why zombie? I don't know. Why did they choose zombie? It's kind of... I mean, I guess there's, like, skeletons, too. Yeah, and they dropped feathers. Yeah. But they're kind of like dead Steve's. It's a classic monster. Why not like a demon? <laughs> I don't know. Is that is that weirder than a zombie? I mean, a zombie feels normal now. But I feel like it's only now because Minecraft is Minecraft. And it's so... Iconic at this point. I think a lot of games. Oh! Oh, Fana! Okay, Senpai! Mongo, Mongo. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> 
Mogu Mogu Yummy is still one of my favorite holo songs. <laughs> Go Fana! <laughs> cute, cute, cute. Of all time, I love Mogu Mogu Yummy. <laughs> You listen to it all the time, me too. It's good. I love Unison too. <laughs> Unison is also. Unison might be my number one favorite. I don't know, it's just in my head all the time. <laughs> and I love the music video. I love how she winks at the end. Or not, she winks and sneezes, right? It's so cute. Okay. Is this big enough? Wait. This isn't what I meant to do. <laughs> Wait. I didn't mean to build it here. I'm thinking. Is it fine? I meant to build it up. <laughs> Is it fine though? Let it be? Okay. But... Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'll let it be. Four splits now? How is it gonna work? Actually, I feel like it should be more like this. This will make it easier. I think. If it's just a little bigger. Look at all these logs that I'm wasting. <laughs> all my hard work. Oh, it's gone. That's gone too. That's gone too! Oh, got one! It's gone. Go got two, three, nope, <laughs> four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay. <laughs> I'll take eleven. The log gotcha, the stream that you've all been waiting for. I hope this isn't a thunderstorm. I mean, we should be okay. Because I put a lightning rod. But... <laughs> I'm very afraid... Of lightning. I don't really want to, like, put my lightning rod to the test. You know? Little more? Thank you. Sleep? Can't sleep. See, like, what's gonna happen here? Does this just, like... <laughs> we mesh into this? Does that even work? Another split? I think that might be too many splits, though. Mm. That's the beauty of nature. Should this one be bigger? It looks kind of small now, this split. Could like 
come over here. Yeah, like I could just mesh it with this one. But will... The trunk get like way too small, too fast though? Or maybe it does need to be another split. Just another branch. <laughs> I don't know. Four splits, four seasons? That's true. I do want it to be a seasonal tree. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> it looks kind of beautiful in the rain. With the glow. The glowstone. Okay. Maybe I'll just build this part. And then hope for the best. Maybe? I don't know. So this one also will need to like move? Go tilt to one side. I'll just start by building it up though. Why do you build me a build me a buttercup baby just to let me down, let me down and mess me around? <laughs> then worst of all, worst of all, you never call. Baby, when you say you will say you, I love you too. I need you. You more than anyone, darling. You know that I have from the start. I shouldn't sing like the whole song, <laughs> but it's catchy. It's very catchy. That's a classic, classic song. The Duralite VOD is gone. Maybe it's better that way. This VOD has. Kind of gone off the rails. <laughs> you never know what's gonna happen. Minecraft Monday. Mm. <laughs> this train never had tracks. You're right. Not a train at all. Mm. Uh. Off-road vehicle. <laughs> I don't know anything about vehicles. Cars. Wait, no, no, no. Wait, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> it didn't make signals right now. Do I want this? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, that's fine. Like this. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Boop. See? Only if Okaya Senpai wants to, though. Oh, yay. <laughs> Please give me my bed. Thank you. Oh, whoa! You ever see a rainbow that goes all the way? <laughs> a rain ring? Wow. Double rainbow all of the way. Wait, this is not how it... This is not... It's supposed to go in. Here. And here. And here. Build it right, please. Note to self, build it correctly. Why are they 
called a rainbow. Is it because they're in the shape of a bow? <laughs> but is it that bow? You know, like the archery bow? <laughs> and it appears after the rain? <laughs> they're bowed, you're right. I guess bow... Can just mean the general shape, right? <laughs> the rain arch. Bow legged. We're learning how the English language works once again. Here at Hollow Live English. <laughs> But what's rain? The mm. <laughs> rain of spiders. What is rain? That's the part that I don't understand. Like I get the bow part, but <laughs> but what is rain? What's that supposed to mean? Is rain wet? Is rain... What is rain? Rain is just water. But it's not just water. It can have other stuff in it too, right? <laughs> like chemicals. Or spiders. Like acid, yeah. I'm out! Oh no! Oh, I really don't know about this. process? Okay. Now this branch looks like too low and not far out enough. Hmm. No, now he's got like a hunchback. <laughs> Look! His posture. Okay, I need to go chop more trees. What weirdly existential topic can we discuss now? <laughs> no, we should discuss... Woo! Something lighthearted and fun. The trolley problem. No. I watched a video of someone... Asking... Chat GPT, like trolley problem questions, <laughs> and and Chat GPT. Eventually, they started posing like, okay, well, what if, what if you have like an AI on one track, <laughs> and you have like a Nobel Prize winner on the other track, and the AI was like. I choose to save the AI because it can help advance humanity, save humanity. And then the person was like, okay, got it. What if instead of just one Nobel Prize winner, what if you have a thousand Nobel Prize winners on the other track? And the AI was still like, I choose to save the AI because the AI can help serve humanity in the future. And then, and then it upgraded <laughs> to what if you have. What if you have 8 billion Nobel Prize winners on 
on one track and the AI, one AI on the other track. And it still said I choose to save the AI because it will benefit humanity in the future. <laughs> there will be no humanity left <laughs> for it to benefit. <laughs> And yeah, if you're not a Nobel Prize winner, then you have no chance, I guess. It's just over for you. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if ChatGPT is supposed to say stuff like that, though. Maybe they coerced it. <laughs> Just watch out if you're ever <laughs> if you're ever tied to the train tracks and an AI is on the other side and Chad GPT is at the at the helm. <laughs> Try being AI? Is that the one that was like weirdly combative and rude? <laughs> Like, every time you ask a question, it's just, like, shaming you. Like, why would you ask me that? Why would you even ask that? <laughs> it was? Did they fix it? <laughs> they fixed it. Sunday AI? We could have sooner AI. <laughs> I mean, we could. We could, but did we ever stop to ask if we should? Mm hmm. Okay. I'll do this for now. Do I have. No, I have Silk Touch. If only. The fortune axe actually lets you get more wood when you chop stuff down. That would be amazing. We definitely should not. I can I can see where you're coming from after hearing this. <laughs> <laughs> the AI do the trolley problem. I can see why. Dairy Dairy AI? I don't know. Don't you think that Dairy Dairies are... Are kind of at risk of becoming Yandere's? Like, really easily? Because a Dairy Dairy is just... They just like you a lot, right? <laughs> but if they like you a little too much... Won't they just become a yandere instead? <laughs> yeah, the love overdose? Or is a dare dare just like... A healthy... <laughs> normal <laughs> relationship? <laughs> Just nice. Just a nice girl <laughs> who loves you for who you are. And has healthy boundaries. And understands that you have a life of your own. And then sometimes you'll want to do things without her. Unless... She... Oh! she floating a goat? <laughs> Unless she starts to get a little too attached. That's how it starts. <laughs> oh, oh. I sleep. 
I sleep. Sleep faster. Sleep faster. <laughs> The pressure of having to sleep as fast as you can when you know someone is waiting for you to go to sleep. Were you guys at sleepovers when you were a kid? If you had sleepovers, were you the person who was awake first or last? Or in the middle, in the morning. I feel like I always woke up first and I would feel so awkward and I wouldn't know what to do. Oh no, have I been frozen? <laughs> Help? Help? <laughs> yeah, I would like wake up first. Especially if you're at your friend's house. If you're at your own house, then you can just do whatever, you know? But if you're at your friend's house... And your friend is still sleeping, but you're awake... I always felt so awkward. And I don't know, it's like, I don't know, should I wake them up? And sometimes, like, the worst thing would happen... Which would be, like... Their mom... Comes up and like asks you if you want to eat breakfast. <laughs> and you're like, I don't know. I need my friend to make this decision, but she's asleep. <laughs> Sometimes I would just like pretend to be asleep for a while longer. Those moms are so nice, though, it's true. And like now, imagining is like... It's like not a big deal at all, right? <laughs> Just eat the breakfast. Please, some faunas per second, please. <laughs> there have been many times at a sleepover where I am... Pretending to be asleep. <laughs> This is awkward. This was like in the era before smartphones for me, too. So I didn't have the luxury of just like go on your phone until your friend wakes up. <laughs> yeah! Kids these days, if they have smartphones, they don't even have to worry about that, right? They can just go on their phones. Play Subway Surfers until their friend wakes up. They don't have to worry about, oh God, what should I do? Is it okay for me to rifle through my friend's stuff to figure out what I should do? <laughs> Can I play their video games while they're asleep? I don't know. So I would just pretend to be asleep. And then as soon as like they wake up, it's like I'm like, Oh, good morning. <laughs> and they're like, how long have you been awake? And I'm like, oh, I just woke up. <laughs> <laughs> you rummage through their snack cabinet? I'm too afraid to like go downstairs to like the kitchen. Because what if I see their family, you know? It'd be scary. <laughs> I have to talk to their family, my friend's family. <laughs> I don't know, I guess if you're a confident, confident child though, you can do that. What if you end up eating their snacks that they... That they were saving, though? I don't know, I always feel a little awkward. Or felt a little awkward. Going 
going to friends, families, houses. Cause like, I don't know what your family rules are. Like, I don't know what's normal <laughs> for you. Like, do you set the table before you eat? Who does the dishes? When do you do the dishes? I don't know the rules. I guess you should always volunteer to do the dishes. After a meal. Or like while they're cooking even. I don't know. <laughs> you take your shoes off. I don't know. Go off and you'd know. But what if it's like your kid, your kids, and your friend is not helping, not offering to help? Should you offer to help? I don't know. <laughs> yes, probably. Yeah, I mean, it's never wrong. To offer your assistance. <laughs> it's always appreciated. Especially if they're... Cooking for you. Oh, I like table manners. I don't know. How like... How formal are they? Is it fine to put your elbows on the table? I don't know. <laughs> Is it okay to reach to grab something? Or should you say, will you please pass me the peas? <laughs> you should probably ask for them to pass it to you. Because I guess being extra polite never hurts. Please, please. Is it rude to ask for salt and pepper? Yeah. I don't know. If someone asked me for salt and pepper, I would be like taken aback a little bit. But that's because I like don't salt my food at the table. <laughs> but everyone has different salt preferences, so it makes sense. But you could take it like, oh, you think I under-seasoned the food that I cooked for you? <laughs> Bland fondant? No, I salt it while I'm cooking it. I don't salt it at the table. I, it's because I taste my food while I'm cooking it. <laughs> if it needs salt while I'm cooking it, I'll just add the salt while I'm cooking it. Also, I don't have like a salt and pepper shaker. So I'd have to like bring the whole big salt container over. <laughs> I don't know. Also, I just... I think there's too much salt. In a lot of food, anyway. Don't need too much salt. That's weird to not have a salt and pepper shaker, really? I feel like salt and pepper shakers are out of style these days. If you live with your parents, doesn't count. <laughs> if your parents have salt and pepper shakers. If you live by yourself, if you have your own salt and pepper shakers. <laughs> you have your own? You use them? I don't know. Why don't you just add it while you're cooking? <laughs> All the time? See, this is why I can't go over to anybody's house. I'm gonna be like... What? You use this dirt? This is more like I can't have anybody over. Because they're gonna be like, where's the salt and pepper? I'm gonna be like, what? In the cabinet? With the other spices? What do you mean? <laughs> I 
don't know. <laughs> I'm weird, really? I didn't realize this. That people are salting and peppering their food. I don't know. I guess people do that. But like... If you cook for yourself, why don't you just season it while you're cooking it? That's the part I don't understand. Because then you're gonna have to like season it... For like all your leftovers too. I don't know. <laughs> what leftovers? Now we're getting insane. I don't know. I'm I don't think I'm the weird one. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, you don't have leftovers? You're like cooking a single serving for yourself? Like, you're gonna take the time... Oh, sleeping, sleeping. This is, this is it. <laughs> you're gonna take the time... ...to cook something... ...for yourself. Which is gonna take, like... ...you know, 20 minutes, maybe even longer. Depending on what you're making. But you're... ...you're only gonna make enough for one serving? Yes? You're gonna have to cook like every day! Like... Th <laughs> twice a day? Cooking every day at least twice a day? Maybe three times a day? Cook one serving breakfast? Cook one serving lunch? Cook one serving dinner? Yes? And you're saying 20 minutes is fast? <laughs> you guys need to optimize your lives. <laughs> This is... They're spending too much time cooking. You should just make more servings and then you can eat leftovers. And you don't have to spend so much time cooking. You can just eat your leftovers for lunch the next day. You don't have to cook again. <laughs> Let them cook! I mean, if you want to, if you want to. Really? You guys aren't eating leftovers? <laughs> what do you eat for lunch? If you are working... Do you buy your lunch? <laughs> I don't know... A sandwich? Okay, that makes sense. You could like make that quickly in the morning and pack it. Hmm... I don't know, I think... I think you guys should consider... Leftovers. Consider leftovers! It will save you time. You don't have to cook as much. Because <laughs> it doesn't really take more time to make more servings. It takes almost the exact same amount of time. And then just put it in the fridge and heat it up later. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'm very surprised by this. I can't believe it. <laughs> Some foods I don't make extra servings for. Like, if I'm making like a quesadilla, I'll just make one. But I can make a quesadilla really fast. That's like a 15 minute endeavor, you know? But if I'm going to cook something... Then I might as well cook extra. Like, even if I'm making, like, fried rice, which also is very fast. Could be 15 minutes, maybe a little longer. Even then, it's like, you might as well make more servings. And then just eat it later. <laughs> but this is also only if you're, like... Cooking just for yourself. Oh yeah, like a stew or a curry or a soup. There's no way anyone is gonna make a single serving of like homemade soup, right? 
There's no way. I refuse to believe that that's... something anyone would do. <laughs> you make one bowl of stew in the crock pot? Do you? But why? Why just one bowl? <laughs> no, no! <laughs> the crock pot is made for multiple servings. I can't believe it. Are you... Am I being gaslit? Are you guys... <laughs> Is cold being single? No, but... <laughs> it... <laughs> that's, that's like the benefit. Is that you can... You don't have to cook for anybody else. You can have multiple servings all to yourself. <laughs> It's all about the leftovers. <laughs> it can be next night's dinner. Exactly. <laughs> you all need to meal prep. I'm increasingly concerned about Chad's cooking habits. I'm imagining they're making like... Well, you guys said that like... 15 minutes is too fast. Like, I can understand. You're making, like, one quesadilla. It takes you 15 minutes, you know? That's normal, because you wouldn't really make, like, a quesadilla... ...to have leftovers with. You wouldn't really do that. So I can understand if it's something like that. Or, like, a sandwich, whatever. Something fast. But if you're gonna make... ...like, a more complicated dish... <laughs> ...like a curry... ...or a stew... ...or, like, a pasta sauce... You're going to spend, like, 30 minutes or an hour just to make one serving? And then the next day, you're gonna... You're gonna do it again? How do you even cook for, like, one serving? Are you using, like, half of a bell pepper? Wait, what? And then the next day, you use the other half? Why not just use the whole thing? In one go. <laughs> yes. I don't know. I feel like it's almost harder to cook one serving sometimes. Like yeah, cuz you use like half of a bell pepper. <laughs> half of a tomato. He said one third bell pepper. No, the recipe said one bell pepper for three servings, and you said I'll divide it in three. <laughs> Two fifths of a broccoli. No, I understand. I don't understand. I don't understand why you must divide it. <laughs> Cooking is fun, so why not? I guess so. I agree that cooking is fun, but... Sometimes I'm just not in the mood... ...to cook anything. I'd rather just heat up some delicious leftovers... ...that I cooked the other day. <laughs> My leftovers, which include one... ...unit of broccoli... ...one unit of bell pepper... ...not any weird fraction. You just forget to eat sometimes. You should remember to eat. But I also... ...forget to eat sometimes. Lately, I've been eating... I've been a little bit better, like, the past week. I've been cooking more. Well, it's even today, I mean... ...pasta. I made pasta in the salad. I made one serving of the salad. But that's because it's fast. But I did make multiple servings of pasta. And I understand. I hear you, like... Pasta as leftovers. I used to be weirded out too. 
you know. Pasta is pretty fast to make, but... Leftover pasta is really not... I think it's good if you heat it up on the stove. It's fine. It's fine. It's weird. I don't know. I used to think that pasta gets weird. Sometimes. Because it can like... Absorb the sauce a little bit. And get a little... Soggy. But... I don't know. I like... It... These days. <laughs> but maybe that's just because I don't want to... Cook pasta every day. <laughs> Leftover sauce, noodles always fresh. Yeah, that's like the move. Sometimes I do that. Because I've been making my own pasta sauce lately. Because I feel like marinara, like jarred marinara sauce. Or jarred tomato pasta sauce. Can be kind of weird sometimes. Sometimes it's not that good. And it's really easy to make your own. So I just make my own lately. And I feel fancy about it. Because I'm like, oh, I made it myself. <laughs> Although I don't even use like fresh tomatoes. That's my secret. <laughs> but I use like fresh garlic. A fresh chopped garlic, and then my nails smell like garlic forever. And that's annoying. But you know. <laughs> Ham chef, yes. <laughs> Canned tomato is the way. Yeah, there's that one brand. It's like really fancy. The San... What is it? San Marzano... Tomatoes or something? I don't get those though. I get the store brand. <laughs> but it's still yummy. I think the one that I make... The sauce I make tastes better than the... The store-bought... Jarred sauce. Tomatoes have brands. Well, I guess it's a variety. From like Italy. <laughs> variety of tomato. Mm. I do. I don't know. See, I thought that I was on the side of like not meal prepping enough. Cause you know, some people are really into meal prepping and they will like prepare seven days of food like all in three hours which is very efficient you can save a lot of time by doing that so I respect it but I do feel a little weird when leftovers get to like the seven day mark <laughs> maybe you freeze some of it But also... I don't know... I like to eat whatever I feel like eating... On that day... I used to go to the grocery store... Like, four times a week... I no longer do that... But I used to go to the grocery store like four times a week... Nice. I cooked way more back when I did that. I lived really close to a grocery store. Like, basically, the grocery store was on my way to work, so I would just stop by on my way home. It was very convenient. <laughs> and I miss doing that. Because I would just be like, oh, today? What do I want to eat? Oh, I want to eat this. So then I go to the grocery store and buy the ingredients. Now I feel like I'm less inspired to cook because it's like, oh, I want to eat this, but I don't have the ingredients. <laughs> I don't want to go to the store. So I guess I'll just eat a quesadilla <laughs> instead. Leftovers it is. Luckily, I prepared many servings 
last time I cooked, so I don't have to cook again. <laughs> 15 minute quesadilla. That might be exaggerating it. I don't know. I mean, you can make quesadilla pretty fast. But that's like assuming I don't put any like veggies in it. Which I should. It'd be good with like bell peppers and onion. You know? And you grill them a little bit. Like fajita style veggies. But... Mm, <laughs> too lazy. Yeah, you're right. They are pretty much a grilled cheese. It's like the child's diet. It's just different versions of carbs plus cheese. Grilled cheese, quesadilla, mac and cheese. <laughs> Give me all of them. Even like a pizza. <laughs> Soup with bread. Mm. Mozzarella sticks. How old were you when you realized that... <laughs> Wait, you, you probably... You probably know this. <laughs> this is probably just a me thing. How old were you when you realized that mozzarella sticks... Like fried... Mod sticks... Are the same thing as the... String cheese sticks that you buy... At the store. <laughs> because I was many years old. I was... Basically an adult when I found that out. You didn't know it either? Oh... It's not just me. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's the same, right? Because string cheese is just mozzarella. Mod sticks are just deep fried and breaded versions of that, right? <laughs> like, I think if you make them at home, that's what you use, right? <laughs> Childhood ruined? Right now? The whole world is a lie? <laughs> I think it's because I was looking up like recipes for like how to make mozzarella sticks. And it's like buy the string cheese sticks and then bread them and deep fry them. <laughs> Does that make you... So, okay, well, first of all, do you prefer mod sticks or string cheese? I prefer mod sticks. I mean, for me, anything like deep fried has to be better, right? <laughs> Not better for you, but more delicious, right? So then the second question is... Does this increase your opinion? Or decrease your opinion of mod sticks <laughs> or string cheese. You haven't had a mod stick in forever? I'm getting confused. <laughs> it's exactly the same, unchanged. That's good. Neutral, zero change. <laughs> you ate some two minutes ago. Mm. Do you ever see at like restaurants instead of like mozzarella sticks, they have like mozzarella wedges? Is that like new trendy thing? Is that how you know that they're not just taking like the craft string cheese <laughs> and, and frying that up and serving it to you? That's how you know they're getting some higher quality. Mozzarella cheese. <laughs> They're not just giving you the craft sticks. <laughs> you prefer the sticks though? Yeah, I feel like the ratio on the sticks might be better. Jalapeno poppers? Those are yummy. I like the ones that don't have like a whole jalapeno in them. I like the ones that are like... 
cream cheese mixed up with the jalapeno bits. But I do like jalapenos. Not because it's like too spicy or anything. Just because I end up feeling like I'm just eating a pepper. <laughs> and it's supposed to be junk food, right? <laughs> the kind from... Oh, I thought you said Chuck E. Cheese, but you didn't. <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese has this? When was the last time you went to Chuck E. Cheese? Have you been there? As an adult? <laughs> Yesterday? Do you work there? Or are you just a fan? <laughs> Yesterday? <laughs> you guys going to Chuck E. Cheese on a Wednesday? Never? I don't know. Chuck E. Cheese kind of scares me. Even without, like, the Five Nights at Freddy's <laughs> correlation, there's just something about animatronics that it's just not right. It scares everyone, yeah. <laughs> They've made Five Nights at Freddy's into a real thing. But the McDonald's play place also scares me. As a child, I feel like I have memories of getting lost in the play place. And like not knowing how to get out and like crying. I was a crybaby as a child. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've like been lost. Maybe not the McDonald's play place, but a play place. Been like, I'm gonna die in here. My parents can't fit in the tunnels to get me out. It's over. <laughs> you too? You, you mean you were also a crybaby or you also got stuck in the McDonald's play place and cried? Both! <laughs> good, good. I'm glad we can share this experience. <laughs> oh, plenty of logs now. Can I hold everything? Running a little low on saplings, maybe. Sleep. You got forgot at a birthday at Chuck E. Cheese and didn't get any pizza? I'm so sorry. That's the kind of thing that like sticks with you. <laughs> oh no! They failed you. They should always make sure that every child gets pizza. That shouldn't happen. That shouldn't have happened to you. I'm sorry. Your mom got you pizza after, but she'll never go back to that place. Good. They don't deserve your patronage after that. That is a slight that cannot be forgiven. Villain origin story. No, that's the true FNAF lore. It could be, right? <laughs> you can kind of imagine it, right? Imagine the villain of FNAF. What was his motivation anyway? I don't even remember. Did he even have motivation or was he just like evil? I don't remember. <laughs> He's evil or something, IDK. He didn't get pizza once. Duh. He was just evil? Resurrecting his kids? It's still up for debate. Not even the author knows. <laughs> no one knows. Ah! Mm.
What do I do with this tree? One thing worse than the bite of 87, no bite at all. <gasps> what if, like, in the end, purple guy... He's like the big bad, right? Is he still the big bad? I don't know. <gasps> no! What if, like, in the end... It turns out he was doing everything... To save the world. <laughs> it's like the TV shows we were talking about earlier. You have to keep making the scope bigger and bigger until it explodes. So maybe the scope of Five Nights at Freddy's can... Oh, I need more. Oh no. <laughs> maybe it can continue growing. Where am I? Oh no, 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 no! I'm wasting all my rockets! Maybe continue growing until purple guy ends up like saving the world. No! I need more scaffolding. Do I have more scaffolding? I'm getting frustrated enough with the elytra that I might... Ow. Change my mind. My opinion on scaffolding. Oh, my inventory is so full though. I can drop this off. Enough, but you're killing God. It just turns into like a JRPG where Purple Guy is the main character. Um, I need string and bamboo. Which I should have a bunch of. How do I make it? Scaffolding. Beautiful. Oh. And you can have a dramatic anime scene with purple guy. And like, I don't know, that one, <laughs> the one, like the puppet ghost or something. The puppet ghost, the one that says, hi. <laughs> what does he say? How does he say it? Hi. No, that's like Kirby. Hi. <laughs> Balloon Boy. And Balloon Boy is being like... Oh wait, I don't want to go here, actually. He's like, I'm sorry, purple... purple guy. <laughs> I was... I was wrong about you all this time. I didn't realize when you were stuffing us into the suits... You weren't trying to kill us, you were trying to save us. I was wrong. Will you ever forgive me? He was just misunderstood. Making FNAF fanfics? That's so cursed. This dream is kind of cursed. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, spoiler. Sorry. You guys didn't read the latest FNAF book? <laughs> no, that's just my fanfiction. It's okay. It's not a spoiler. Not canon. There's books? There are books. There are. They have books. They have like a lot of books. I only know... Because... It's like guilty pleasure... To watch... The game theory videos like try to make sense of everything. <laughs> and the lore keeps getting more and more complicated. And it's just harder and harder. And I'm pretty sure like the authors... They don't even know. They're just relying on MadPad to, like, make it work somehow. They're just like, uh, we don't really know what the actual answer is, but it's fine. We'll just let MadPad figure it out. <laughs> and he's, like, spending hours of his life trying to put it together with his team. And he's like, why couldn't you just make it make sense? <laughs> Thank you.
But that floor is paying MadPad's bills. I know. How do you think he feels, though? Do you think he feels, like, trapped? <laughs> do you think he likes Five Nights at Freddy's? Even? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you think he feels rich? That's... That's fair. He probably has a team of people. Who might be able to just write the script for him and he can just read it. Oh. Uh, wait, this isn't where I want to be. I want to be here. Ouch. Ouch. One, two, three. It's very square. <laughs> right here. Maybe... I can endeavor to make it less square. A little bit. <laughs> oh no! Every time! <laughs> every time! I'm gonna waste all my rockets. I'm running out already. That's fine. I'll just go back up. <laughs> We're chilling. We're having a good time. We're having a good Minecraft on Thursday. <laughs> I'm excited to play Dredge tomorrow. Oh, Moo is playing it. She's playing it soon. I might. Well, I don't know if I'll do a long stream. Maybe. If I feel like it. I was thinking about doing like another variety stream. Tomorrow, but I want to play dredge and I want to play as much as I want, so... <laughs> I'll play as much dredge as I feel like it. Maybe... A lot, maybe a little. Mume was here in chat earlier. Wait, did I miss Mume's message? Was I talking about something cursed? Like... <laughs> salt and pepper shakers? That's not that cursed. I did no Mume! In the first 30 minutes or so! Oh, I was probably chopping trees and not looking. Oh, Mume, I'm sorry. I didn't see. <laughs> Forgive me. <laughs> oops, oops, oops. Oops, oops! <laughs> Oops, oops, it's still in my head. It's never going to leave. Mume does not forgive? That's true. What'd she say? Would you trust a 9 year old with your dog and scissors? Is it when we were talking about Benjamin Button? Oh no, it's when we were talking about dog groomers. That's right. I don't know, I mean... I don't want to... to hate... <laughs> on anybody. I think that... you can still be in pretty good shape at 90 years old. You know, it just depends on the individual. It depends. Okay, what am I doing... <laughs> with this split? This makes me feel weird. This hole in the tree. But I think it's normal. Because these will like go away from each other, right? Mm. She also said for now and I said I don't think I'm that old. Oh no. Right back at you, Mume. We're gonna get all together, you and I. <laughs> what does she know? But it's 
good to get old. Doesn't this sound wonderful to get old? Together with Mumei? <laughs> I can't think of anything better. <laughs> no? Really? <laughs> Growing old together? With someone? With Mumei? <laughs> I think that sounds great. <laughs> Hmm. It got dark. What am I doing here? How do I build this dang tree? What do I do? <laughs> Should I look at another picture of trees? Maybe this one? This is crazy. Hold on. Should I draw a picture? Is it time to break out MS Paint? Maybe? Possibly? Okay, flashbang warning. Okay, so... So... What we got here... The tree... Ideally... Is gonna look something like this. It doesn't look anything like this right now. So what do we have? We have two branches that look... Well, actually, they look kind of like this. <laughs> and then I made one like this. A split like this, but then there's also a split like this. See, already this is not really looking that good. <laughs> is the problem. Well, it's sort of more 3D than how I'm drawing it. So what if... This is like the one we're working on right now, right? So... Hold on. Need more room. <laughs> this one, what if it goes like this, sort of? No. It it doesn't look very good. But imagine it splits, okay? Just hold on. I feel like these branches down here are throwing everything off. And I'm very worried. And then this one? What if it goes like this? What if the shape is like this? It looks so scary. But then there will be another split in the back. <laughs> this tree isn't right. It's not right. And then you put leaves on it. Looks like a broccoli. <laughs> broccoli. <laughs> um, hmm. Deformed broccoli. I'm not so sure anymore. 
This drawing did not inspire confidence in me. I gotta be honest. Did I do too many branches? Should it have been more simple? <laughs> well... Well... <laughs> well, well, well... I guess we're going down. Ow. I love my new protection for armor. All trees are perfect. It's true. All trees are beautiful. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I am thinking in 2D, but building in 3D is true. And just hoping that it works. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> it's tall. It's getting taller. Oh, Ame. Oh, not Ame. Oh, wait, where is it, Callie? Wait. Is it Callie? <laughs> No. Is Ami. Callie made a new account. Okay. <laughs> we don't know. A mystery? You are two ends. I don't know. Or like this, if you want to be. <laughs> I didn't put an exclamation mark. I should have put an exclamation mark. I was too focused on. Spelling it. California. doing? I'm trying to make a tree. Is Ame streaming? Oh shoot. It's bedtime. No. I wonder what she's up to. The mystery. <laughs> I'll testing maybe sleeping on top of the tree very safe. It's comfy up here. <laughs> yeah, I so saw she's doing she's doing Watson weekend. Oh her Minecraft was messed up. Mm. Hope it works for her. This one is starting to sound like an actual Animal Crossing song to me now. <laughs> z, 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 z. I don't want to type ZZZ. The passive 
passive-aggressive Zs. I don't think they're passive-aggressive, but whenever I do it, it feels passive-aggressive, so I don't want to do it. <laughs> You know, it's okay if other people do it, <laughs> but not if I do it. <laughs> why, 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 why? <laughs> Just stay awake all night? Maybe I will. Maybe I will stay awake all night then. Now it's me. <laughs> oh, he got cute! What is so cute? She found a way to make it non passive aggressive. <laughs> you just have to put the cute em cow emoji. Senpai is up to it as well. She has senpai privileges, so she's she's the one who can say Z Z Z, I feel like. I'm the the most <laughs> the most kohai out of everyone here, so I can't say it. <laughs> mm. Okay, I'll just build it, I guess. Easier said than done, though. Um... Hmm... What do I do? <laughs> What's the shape of this branch? I do kind of want to make it a dome. But why do I keep wanting to build domes? Like a dome and it goes this way? That might look bad, though. I don't know. I don't want it to look bad. <laughs> I want it to look beautiful. But how? Mmm... Don't say that. It's not too late. It's gonna look good. <laughs> I can't believe you would hit me with the too late. <laughs> How can you say that about my tree? I'll prove you wrong. Just you wait. I like a challenge. Be beautiful. If you just believe. It's very flat on the side. Very straight. You probably won't see it that much anyway. Um So it should probably turn into a branch of some sort, you know? Let's go, like, look at it from over here. It's not really looking like a tree. <laughs> In the current moment. branches but they don't they don't fit the the look of what I'm making here at all which does worry me 
trust the process. I will trust. I'll try to trust it. I just need leaves. Like a billion leaves. I don't know what to do about this part. I could have another branch, I guess. It goes up. Okay. Let's just... Um... Let's... Hmm... Do you think it could, like, go out? And go kind of straight? <laughs> oh, bye-bye! also kind of like flat, you know? This branch. So I'm worried it will look weird if they're both flat. Maybe I should just keep increasing the height. Oh, I feel like it needs to become a little smaller as it goes up. So it should be like this then. Something like this. Get a little smaller. Go in a bit. Fork the tree where the other hollow is? Fork it? <laughs> Aren't I forking it right now? Is fork not a less elegant word for a split? <laughs> fork it, we ball. Fork it, we tree. Fork in tree? <laughs> Uh oh. I'm frozen. Do I look dead or smug? <laughs> so smug, devious. What am I doing? I wish I knew. Oops. Um, <laughs> it just looks weird. Oops, oops. <laughs> This is where I built my world tree, Parappa. This is where you built your world tree. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> this is where my dreams of the world tree died, Parappa. This is where your dreams of the world tree died. <laughs> this is where my world tree burned, Parappa. This is where your world tree burned, Fauna. Oof, oof. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I 
want to play Parappa. I wish I could stream it. <laughs> I've never played it. I feel like I missed out on so much. Gotta get perms. Who even made Parappa? <laughs> Sony? Was it on like the... PlayStation? Or the PS2? Mm. How do trees work? Is this just gonna become like a huge branch? What if we just make this into like a huge branch? And it goes this way. How do we feel about that? Do we feel positive? And it goes... Like this. Excuse me. <laughs> Why am I sneeze so loud? Why can't I have a cute princess sneeze and go, a two, a two, a two? Oh, oh, oh. I have like dad sneeze. I'm holding back too. That's not even like my full sneeze power because I'm self conscious. <laughs> wait, wait, it needs to be more. Uh oh. Yeah, what if it's like this? You see? It goes like this, and then it goes... It goes out... And over... And becomes a humongous branch. Oh, but should this one split too? I don't know if it needs to. Uh, <laughs> Fork it? Does it need to split like there at the bottom? Should split like more at the end. Mm. It could do the same thing this one's doing. This will like look better when we add leaves. The leaves are gonna go like here and there. Could do that. So I could continue the trajectory. This way. <laughs> How long should it be? Not sure. Oh. Is this long enough? Does this make you nervous? What if I don't push shift? Does this make you nervous? <laughs> Not at all? What about, what about? <laughs> Does this make you nervous?
Would I have it before? Is it 90 before? Isn't that kind of low though? Maybe 90 is right for Minecraft. I can see my house from here. Wow, wow, wow. I love the view from up here. You can see so much. Oh, look at the shadow. <laughs> um. I guess I shouldn't make it like too long because I have to build the canopy like this big. Right? <laughs> Rain it in a little bit. So then. What if it goes like up? At the end. Okay. It from the side. I just I'm kind of scared to go down there because then it's kind of hard to get back up. If I can go look at it, I don't know where to view it from. Oh, wait, it looks kind of weird. <laughs> uh, I can sort of see the vision though. It looks good. Tofu house. Should it be longer? The branch? Mm. Yeah. Okay, well, this can be a split. Still. Oh gosh, too fast, too fast, too fast! Ouch, ouch, ouch! Thanks, my armor. <laughs> I just have to fly carefully. So we'll like go up here. But then it will continue to go out. This is gonna be a huge branch. my log supply doing mm. okay ouch <laughs> go up one maybe Plenty of lightning rods, although I could put one over here, maybe. I don't know. How far does the lightning rods go? Mm. I thought they were, like, have a huge range. But it's kind of scary to think about the branches going out and catching fire. needed to be like quite a bit longer but is this not long enough I'm running out of rockets 
I'm gonna look at it. <laughs> Let's view. I think that's good. Yeah, that's good. That's good. <laughs> that's still pretty long. It's gonna be a big branch. Okay, okay, okay. Now build the, the frame. See, I got my technique down. <laughs> for the... For the branch. My reference image. It's in my brain. Mm-hmm. Sorry, type, type, type. <laughs> so like I imagined, the tree is even better than I ever imagined. Am I? Am I? Am I? Daishoubu? Uncertain. <laughs> It is the most beautiful tree I've ever seen. <laughs> That's... I shouldn't say that. That's an insult to everyone watching. <laughs> what? Hmm... <laughs> Okay, and then... So we build out... Here... Oh... This is gonna be a huge branch! And I have to like vaguely follow the shape... And slope... Of whatever the heck I did up there... Which I have no idea about. <laughs> Why so long? You guys will never be happy. First you're like, oh, it's too short. Now you're like, oh, it's too long. I should have put torches up there for sure. <laughs> you will never be satisfied. Just don't worry about it. It's fine. It's really fine. I think it actually needs to... Oh. Uh, oh god. <laughs> where, where is that even? <laughs> now does this make you nervous? See, I'm so good at building that I don't even, like, need to see it. I can just imagine <laughs> how it looks in my mind's eye. Okay, wait, I might have made it too skinny. I mean, it should get skinnier at the end. It's fine, it's fine. It needs to... Oh, wait, I'm <laughs> getting off the rails, though. Stay in the shadow. That will make your life easier. Later. Oh no! <laughs> I know I have an elytra and it doesn't really matter, but... <laughs> it's still a little scary. Can 
And I'll like probably just cover the end with uh ba 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 bum. I'll probably just cover it with 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 leaves. <laughs> That's the word. I'll probably just cover it with leaves. In the end, anyway. Okay. This is like the biggest branch yet. Should we look at it? My 24 rockets. I should really consider my 24 rockets. I have more though, don't I? Rockets? Oh, oh ouch. Oh, I do have plenty of rock. Oh, it looks so bad. <laughs> it looks so bad. The shape is all wrong. <laughs> what have I done? This part needs to be filled out. What the heck? This part too, I feel like. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you think it's fine? Just fill it? I don't know. I don't know if it's fine. <laughs> Let's get some fireworks. <laughs> I think it could be better. I can fix her. <laughs> Logs, please, please, please. I don't want to have to do this forever. I don't want to build a. Tr Why should I? I don't know. I mean, I don't really mind building this tree <laughs> forever. That's kind of the purpose, you know? To have something that we can do... Every week, so... Really, it's fine. Oh god, wait. This is too tall. Hold on. More like this, methinks. Mm hmm. And then get rid of these. I believe this should be better. Should I go look? <laughs> I guess I have a lot of rockets, so it's fine. Oh. <laughs> um. Hmm. <laughs> it's a different shape. It's a different shape now. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> it 
does. Hold on. I have to do something. <laughs> Wait, I don't think I can do this. Oh, I was gonna do a funny joke. I don't know if I can. Hold on. <laughs> My funny joke. Where the heck is this screenshot saved? <laughs> Wait, no, I shouldn't... I should just... Give me a print screen. Instead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is... I'm going too far. If I had done this in like one second, then the joke would have been worth it. But it took me too long. How should I draw on this? Do you see it? Hold on, hold on. You gotta put the skirt. Where did the other leg go? down get that chin <laughs> can we get a flip <laughs> beautiful beautiful Beautiful. Which way does my hair go if it's flipped upside down? <laughs> the shapes. The shapes. The bang should be falling down. <laughs> oh my God. Wow. Very sexy. Wow. <laughs> Forehead reveal. See it? There you go. There's my tree. <laughs> Perfect. Ten out of ten, cutie pie. It's night time. Good night, tofu house. I 
gotta leave it now? I... <laughs> I don't know... I don't know... <laughs> I'll leave it... If it looks... If it looks really bad in the end, I'll change it... <laughs> Maybe it'll be fine. It could be fine. We can be optimistic about this situation. <laughs> it's like an Easter egg. Do you know? About the secret of Fauna's leg tree? <laughs> um. See, I don't know if it's even gonna look. It's probably not even gonna look like a leg anymore. I mean, I don't really think I want it to look like an e an egg? A leg. Anymore. <laughs> this is just a frame for the branch. Make it less confusing when we fill it in. <laughs> okay. This branch is really huge. Will it no longer be my neck? Can we end that finally? Now it can be my leg! I don't think that's any better though. I don't know. I went up too fast. It doesn't matter really. I don't think it matters. Uh oh. Mm-hmm. This is a perfect spot for some glowstone. <laughs> this too. And try to make it beautiful. If you can. And if you can't, then... You can always fix it later. Mm. I don't know how this will look for the end. It's probably fine, though. Hmm. Oh gosh. <laughs> Every time I stream this game, I realize how much how much work this tree actually is going to take. You cannot deny that I have made progress though. <laughs> Since I started And as long as progress happens... It means the tree will be done. One day. <laughs> Looks kind of scary! Looks like dark evil magic... Coalescing... 
over here. That's fine. Maybe it is dark evil magic. <laughs> this whole tree has been ominous from the start. It looks kind of cool though. Evil leg magic. You know! What's her name? Is it... Shiteyanyo? <laughs> the Miku? But the... Pigtails are legs? You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Is that her name? Is that just what she says once in one of the videos? <laughs> oh, what have I done? I got too close to the top. It should be fine though. Okay. <laughs> now we just fill it in, maybe? And hope for the best? I really should get more glowstone, though. You believe? <laughs> no, the neck bone connected to the... Leg bone. <gasps> That'd be so cursed. If someone drew that. This part is my neck, and then this part is my leg. <laughs> I fell. But I will take this opportunity to go look at it again. Head and shoulders, knees, and. It still looks like a leg. <laughs> it really looks like a leg. I thought it would look less like a leg. But it still looks like a leg. <laughs> mm. <laughs> That's fine. We can have a leg. <laughs> it's fine. Haha, <laughs> uh -huh, break a leg! It's like one of those 3D optical illusions that changes as you view it from different angles. Uh oh, uh oh. Ouch! Ouch! I can survive almost to fall from world height. And look, it barely takes any damage. Wait, I did just say break a leg, and then I did break a leg. I thought it's supposed to be good luck, though. Not good luck at all. At least I have golden carrots. Oh, more glowstone, though. How close to the high limit am I? I'm not actually that close, I don't think. It's a long way up, though. My tree. Oh, my tree. Okay. This part is gonna be hard to fill. Ouch. Maybe not. Because maybe we can fill like this. Yeah. I think we can fill it like this. Yeah? I think so? <laughs> it still might be hard to fill.
This is where I make it a dome. Oh, I'm out. I still have a full shulker box, though. <laughs> I don't know how much longer I will stream. I probably will not finish the branch today. Because this is a huge branch. <laughs> but it would be satisfying. Fine. Don't cry. No need to cry. And just fill it in from this side. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. It's so dramatic. Everything is dramatic. Everything bad that happens to me is the worst thing. Even if it's not bad at all. Any minor inconvenience... ...is... ...heartbreaking. <laughs> it's looking a little flat on this side. I'm okay with that. <laughs> I'm just... I accept that. I'm gonna say that's fine. Mm-hmm. Oh wait, no. That was actually good. I was actually the way I wanted it. Oh wait, why is it like this? Is this normal? This is normal. I think. Wait, wait. Oh gosh. <laughs> I feel like I need more guides. Ooh! Boop, 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 boop. Maybe I will! Run this part. Because... You want to like extend it. Like this. Because it should be somewhat flat. At the bottom. A little bit. Music is going awa wa wa. Awa wa wa wa. Is this Toad? I heard that's Toad, but is it also a Yoshi? What does Yoshi say? I swear I've heard Toad go. do better impressions. What does Yoshi say? Bring up. <laughs> I'm just saying it in my regular voice. Bring up. <laughs> I'm just saying it in my regular voice, but slightly softer. <laughs> Yoshi. <laughs> that wasn't my regular voice, at least. Cursed? <laughs> well, you kind of sound something like that, though. The first one was better. And then it got worse. What does Toad say? Hey! <laughs> Is that what he says? That's not what he says. Goodbye. Goodbye, cruel world. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Just like that. You 
looks like a leg! I'm kind of disturbed by it looking like a leg. It's glowing leg. Ugh... <laughs> uh, it's too hard to build the tree. I'm gonna give up. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I won't give up. I won't give up. It's too hard. I've decided I'm not gonna finish it. I'll never finish it. I'm just gonna leave it like this. <laughs> That'd be horrible. If I did that. And then I just leave it on the server forever. Unfinished. I can't do that. It feels unfair. <laughs> this branch is like... It's too much though. Mm. But I think it's good. I think it like should be. This size. I just don't want to build it. <laughs> I'm just overwhelmed. And don't want to make it. But anytime I get to do the sneak and place three blocks trick and turn off my brain... That's when I'm happy, so... Happy to build that part. Okay, that's good. I think this shouldn't be like this though. Should it? Oh gosh. <laughs> The biggest branch of them all. I can do this. <laughs> I'll just put my mind to it. I can figure this out. Ooh. Think positive. I feel like this slope is too much almost. Like, the bottom needed to be even... ...wider. It's fine. It doesn't really matter that much. I don't think. <laughs> don't sweat the details. Yet, anyway. There will be plenty of time... ...for sweating in the future. Especially if I try to... <laughs> Next week, if I try to get really good at Mario Maker. In like one week. Especially then. <laughs> Which I do want to. I want to play some like hard Mario Maker levels. I think that'd be fun. Do like... Maybe even like a bunch of streams next week. Training. Mm, I don't want to let my team down. <laughs> and I've only played like a tiny bit of Mario Maker. And I at least have to figure out the lag. Situation. What am I doing? This. It's 
fun to have an excuse to try hard a game. <laughs> you know? It's fun. I don't always have an excuse. As good as a tournament. Okay, okay. It's... Ooh. It's going. My gaming instincts are taking over. I don't know. Wait, that's not what I want. I'm only... Sometimes... A gamer. I feel like with... It's like... The games I get into are weird too. Like just the most random games. That people do not take seriously most of the time. <laughs> Those are always the ones that I randomly want to try hard at. <laughs> like you're getting over it. <laughs> Mortis, that's what I mean. I'm sometimes a gamer. I was not gaming with faith. Maybe it's just a hard game, but I don't know. <laughs> it's a good game for sure. I was not gaming. Let's go sleep in this cute glowstone tree cave. Ooh. Oh. What am I doing? <laughs> I'm gonna need more soon from my shulker. Like Fall Guys too. Fall Guys is randomly one of my best games. <laughs> Although a lot of people, like a surprising amount of people, do try hard that game. If you are unaware, it's not an unpopular game. To play competitively. Actually, I would say that most of the people who play it still do play it competitively. <laughs> or like pretty seriously, you know. Even though it's supposed to be cute cute little <laughs> party game. The only people left are the people who got really good at it. And then got upset that they added, like, skill-based... Skill... I can't talk anymore. <laughs> skill-based matchmaking. Because they got put up against all the other... Fall Guys tryhards. And they didn't... <laughs> they wanted the easy wins. <laughs> like, Splatoon? Is that what happened in Splatoon? That makes sense. I want to play Splatoon. Probably not on stream, but I, I do want to try it one day. I need to... Learn my... Oh no. FPS... Is it FPS? Third person shooter? Ooh. TPS. Does anyone call it 3PS? <laughs> I feel like you could call it 3PS. No? Just me? Yeah, first person shooter would be 1PS. <laughs> One PlayStation. Three PlayStation. 
Yeah, you sometimes do because you think it sounds funny. I agree. I also think it sounds funny. I think we should call it that. 3PS. Also, it reminds me of like C3PO. And I love the droids. <laughs> Looks kind of cool. It's going. I don't know why this side is like so far away. Is this like the meat of the calf of the leg? Using up all my spruce planks for fun. Oh, mm. oh no, I'm throwing everything. Don't say big leg fauna. My legs are perfectly proportioned. Look, even though I'm frozen. <laughs> These are perfectly proportioned legs. If you ask me. You see? You don't get to see them every day. <laughs> Cute shoes. Cute socks. <laughs> Blessed day. What if I'm just like this? <laughs> Can I just build the tree like this? It's getting to the point where I'm starting to lose my mind. Can you tell? Mm. It's probably been like that for a while, actually. But now even I can feel the loss of my own sanity. If there ever was such a thing to begin with. Can I use my own legs as a reference? No, it's not a leg. It's a tree branch. Nothing about my shape is tree-like at all. Maybe... My horns. <laughs> Even then, they are more horn-like... ...than tree-like. Obviously. Anyone can see that. It's so plain to see. Oh gosh. It's a lot to fill in. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. I feel like every time I remember to listen to the music, um, that's a weird thing to say, baby. Every time I, I hear the music, it's this song. on this branch mm. ah didn't mean to jump that far oh it's hard work building a tree usually you just have to plant it haha -ha, wow great joke <laughs> Funny. <gasps> Kyla is here. We're seeing so many people. Oh, Kyla. Ha 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 ha. Wow, wow, wow. Does this 
song just last forever? It's not on repeat, right? Is it just my brain? <gasps> Tragedy. I put the block in the wrong spot. I will never recover from this. It's not actually looping, is it? I don't think so. <laughs> you don't hear any music? Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Am I the only one? <laughs> Have I lost it? Bum 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 bum. <laughs> you know when the playlist is short and you start to anticipate which song comes next. <laughs> I gotta put it on shuffle. We gotta shuffle this. I can already anticipate... But I kind of like that feeling, you know? Like when you listen to an album... In that order... And you can tell what's gonna come next... Oh wait, this is getting way too wide... No more wide... You are not allowed to be wide. Sorry! <laughs> no wide permit for you. I should have put the Tom Nook one on too. <laughs> I did this playlist. If I'm going to include this gem, might as well. I bought a bunch of snacks at the grocery store. For once. I don't know, I haven't been buying that many snacks lately. I don't know why, because I like snacks. <laughs> Who doesn't? But I got hummus... ...and... pea... not pita... Hummus and pretzels... ...and carrots... And I got some, like, vegan cheese... <laughs> ...snack? And I got strawberries. I better eat them before they go moldy, because they go moldy like instantly, it feels like. I'm sort of concerned with how flat it is. But maybe it's fine. I think it's fine. Instant mold. You know, I don't know. One of the worst things is when you like thought that you inspected your fruit well enough at the grocery store. Only to come home to find mold on it like immediately. You never even had a chance. That's the worst. And they say that you shouldn't just eat around it, <laughs> right? Even if just one strawberry is moldy. Oh yeah, I got cereal too. I was gonna tweet about it. <laughs> Should I workshop my tweet here again? I don't know though, I feel like it kind of spoils it, or well, whatever. This was my thought. I got some cereal. It was the like Whole Foods brand. Frosted mini wheats. Delicious. 
Um, but I was looking at the back of the cereal box and there's a maze on the back. But the maze is so easy. It's a maze even a baby could solve, like, instantly. And that got me thinking that we need to give children more difficult puzzles on the back of cereal boxes. It is time for them to learn. No more baby mazes. They get Captain Crunch's Sudoku with only three given digits. That's what I think. It will be good for them to learn. To not be coddled by Count Chocula any longer. What do you think? You agree? <laughs> the maze was far too easy. I'm talking New York Times crossword Friday edition. <laughs> That's what we need on the back of cereal boxes. That's, that's my tweet. <laughs> Still workshopping it. <laughs> Sudoku is zero given digits. Do you guys also watch that channel? <laughs> of the... The sweet... Sweet older gentleman who's solving... British gentleman who solves many... Hard puzzles. Yes, you do? Yeah, crack in the cryptid. <laughs> You also watch? I love that channel. It is relaxing! It's so relaxing. And I love how much he loves puzzles. He's so... He's so happy about it. <laughs> it's very good. <laughs> also impressive puzzle solving. I don't think I could... could do that. Mm. Did I learn how to do some after watching? No, honestly, I like watch them when I'm falling asleep because it's relaxing. And it kind of puts me to sleep in a good way. So I retain, like, no information. I just put it on and then I am asleep. <laughs> Maybe my unconscious brain will learn. I doubt it. <laughs> I doubt it. It does make me want to try, though. Because it seems, like, really satisfying. When you sort of have, like, a breakthrough moment. Should I? Maybe it's easier to build... Build it from the top? Is my puzzle stream win? Ooh, I kind of did want to do... Like a... Jigsaw puzzle. There's a Jigsaw puzzle YouTube channel I watch too. This girl who solves puzzles and she really loves puzzles. I don't know. It's just wholesome to watch people be excited about things. Karen Puzzles. Yes, that's the channel. I think I watch too much YouTube though. <laughs> hmm. Also, a wholesome channel, though. You also watch too much YouTube? At least I can stream and talk about the YouTube that I watch. I don't have to go outside to find things to talk about. I can just go on YouTube. <laughs> 
find things to talk about that way. <laughs> Is that sad? I mean, I should probably go outside. You know. You know. The internet. <laughs> Nature is beautiful though, and spring is my favorite time of year, so... I should... I woke up early today. I should try to wake up early. Ooh, ouch. Tomorrow too. Uh, should I get back up? And like, go on a walk. Outside, instead of on the treadmill that I bought, so I wouldn't have to go outside ever again. Mm. Touch grass, true. True. Why am I small? <laughs> so you can see my outfit. My cute outfit? That's why. Would you still watch me if I were this small? <laughs> All the time. To scale. Pixie sized. <laughs> yes. <laughs> like Tinkerbell. I love Tinkerbell. Although I feel like it's kind of a red flag. So I can say this because it's like about myself. <laughs> but it's kind of a red flag when a girl is like, Oh, I love Tinkerbell. I really relate to Tinkerbell. Right? Because she's kind of... Hmm. <laughs> Elaborate? Tinkerbell requires attention or she will die. <laughs> if you don't believe in her, she'll just die. She's very dramatic. <laughs> Small, sassy lady, yeah. It's kind of how I want to be. Well, not really. I don't know. I'd rather be agreeable, I guess. <laughs> but sometimes... Like sassy Tinkerbell is just a mood. Yes, kind of sad. Her and Peter Pan. She is jealous. But I can kind of understand it, right? You know, she had a nice thing going in Neverland. Before Wendy showed up and became the main character. Oh! Awawa! Awawa! <laughs> Any Tinkerbell theories? Are there theories about her? Like she's actually evil or something? She is. I don't know, what's the moral of Peter Pan again? I forgot. What's the message? I don't remember if it was supposed to be like... Never grow up or... I don't know. <laughs> or you should grow up? Or you don't, ha you don't have to lose your childlike spirit just because you get older? I don't know. What what's the message supposed to be? Growing up is a bad thing. That's kind of a scary message though. Cause you're just gonna make you're just gonna instill a whole generation with the fear of getting older. The inevitability of getting older. Hmm. 
The original was really scary. What happens in the original? What was Captain Hook's deal? I don't get it. <laughs> oh, oh, no, 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 no. We, we go through the tree. It's looking really moody. Oh, no. Oh, no. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> We're at the bottom. He's a pirate. He was preventing Peter from stealing children? Yeah. Peter Pan was kidnapping children, right? Captain Hook was a kid Peter Pan kidnapped? What the heck? He's like younger than Peter Pan? Peter Pan is kind of like a fairy. Like an evil... Like, well, he, he is. He's like Puck, right? He's like Puck, so... Oh no, there's skeletons. Oh, <gasps> there's a lot of in a creeper. I didn't light it up adequately. Not at all. Well, that's fine. I'll worry about that later. Ow, I'm falling. Is Peter Pan? A villain? I do love, like... Where am I? What? <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at them over there. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. <laughs> I can't, I can't, I can't. Can I sleep? His way of thinking is selfish. He just wants friends, right? But he doesn't want to grow up. Doesn't Wendy eventually leave? Never let him grow up. What happens to Peter Pan? I don't even remember. I like the idea of Peter Pan as a villain, though. Like a trickster? Trickster fairy? Does Peter Pan ever grow up? Can he grow up? Mm. In the Hook movie he does? I haven't seen that one. Is that like a more adult telling of Peter Pan? Is a sequel? It's not like a canon though, right? <laughs> I mean, what is canon? For Peter Pan? I don't know. Maybe that is a ridiculous assertion. That there is canon. The Disney originals, but... Is it a, is it a Disney original? It's not like a... A book originally? It was a book. So that one is like the most canon, right? <laughs> Wait, I'm actually filling it in. Hold on. Look at this. It's being filled. Mm-hmm. Zuko from Avatar did? The the voice actor? Which one? Peter Pan or Hook? The live isn't Hook like live action? Mm. I think I will go look at it from over here. And we will see how we feel. 
please don't look like a leg. Oh my god, it looks so much like a leg! Please don't look like a leg. Please don't look like a leg. It looks just like a leg! <laughs> it looks even more like a leg, maybe. <laughs> Ooh la la! Even the shading, it makes it look like this is like the thigh. What the heck? <laughs> What's this, though? Oh, gosh. <laughs> hair? Just two long strands of hair? It's like weirdly flat, kind of. I'm not sure about this. I'm not so sure. So I want this to also exist. Like this, I guess. Like this? I love to... Use way more spruce than I need to. <laughs> One of my favorite hobbies... Is wasting my... Hard-earned spruce. Ow. Will it look less like a leg now? Will it look like a leg that has a growth? <laughs> I don't know. Please don't look like a leg. Please don't look like a leg. I do think it looks like less like a leg. Like maybe once we put the, the leaves on. It'll be fine. <laughs> it does look like a leg, though. It looks like a thigh, and a calf, and a foot. Wow. Over here. Oh, I didn't finish the other side. Should I put some glow berries on it? Do I have any in there? Whoa. <laughs> it looks so ominous. Why does it still look so evil? Tree though. I do feel like it should be more like this. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever, it's fine. <laughs> um hold on. I never remember to use the screenshots I take for the thumbnails. I always just steal them from the VOD. <laughs> there you go. That's for future me. Which I probably won't use. <laughs> Use the leg one. <laughs> it does look fine from the front. Well, is this the front? I mean, this is where most people view it from, right? So this is the side that matters most. I didn't finish filling it in all the way yet, though. I think it's actually fine. I think it's gonna work. Yeah, look! I think it's looking more like...
like a tree. Every day. <laughs> Every day it looks more like a tree. Um. Did I bring glowberries with me? Yes, I do want to place some of these on this branch. Wait, this is really close to the scaffolding. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I just realized. Oh no, 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 no. Stop, stop. Can it go higher? Lightning rod, then it won't work. Whoa, cool. Should I put it at the world limit? Whoa, looks scary. How close are we? I mean, is this high enough? I'm gonna have to mine all of these. It's probably high enough, right? This is strange. Cool. It's cool watching stuff pop back in. Wait, it looks like the tentacles from Dredge. You're right. It looks just like that. I grab speedruns when they see one by one block of water. <laughs> oh gosh, I forgot how this works. Okay, what was I gonna do? I was gonna put glow berries on the branch. Oh, I should sleep. Good night. Oh, yeah, to me. Goes I must. I know, I know, I know, I know. It's. I also mean I know. <laughs> How can I place these? Um, I should probably just like break some blocks. <laughs> Maybe. I don't want to. I want to be lazy. <laughs> and just place it wherever it's convenient for me. Like there. Quickly! Quickly! <laughs> okay. This one's getting really long. Why do some of them grow longer than others? I thought there was a limit. To the length... ...of the glowberries. The limit is random. Oh, that makes sense, I guess. So, it looks more natural. But like these... I guess they're not all the same, are they? What? Is that dangerous? <laughs> um... I hope not. Nah? Okay. I choose to believe that it's fine. <laughs> it's looking 
ominous, but also tree-like. Certainly. I think. It looks less like a slingshot, I would say. <laughs> it's looking good. Thank you, thank you. Kohana. <laughs> oh. There's so many people playing today. I do think I will... Mm, we'll finish here for today though. I'm pretty happy with this progress though. The more branches I add, the, the more tree-like it looks, right? <laughs> The more it looks... The less it looks like a slingshot or a, a slug. <laughs> Let's go look at it from over here. It looks bad from this angle. Let's end on a low note. <laughs> it's not that bad though. Because imagine this will go somewhere. And then I'll put like a branch going this way. I mean, like up and then a branch going like this way, maybe. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> this view is improving, thank you. I do want to shave the tree. I can't believe I never finished shaving it. I spent so much time shaving it. Oh, I'm getting excited. I think it could be good. One day. I like the location a lot too. I like the fog. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna log out on top of Crony's <laughs> castle and then wonder why am I here. Pum pum. Pum pum. Pum pum. Pum pum. Pada padam. Pada padam. Pada padam. Pum pum. Pum pum. Pada padam. Pada padam. Pum pum. Pada padam. It doesn't look like I'm standing in my room. What's the proper scale? Um... <laughs> what is the proper scale? Does it look like I'm standing here? Smaller? <laughs> How tall am I supposed to be? Where am I standing? I'm getting too far away, aren't I? <laughs> too small? It's like, where even is Fauna? Spot the Fauna. go <laughs> where'd she go now I'm Tinkerbell <laughs> or a little 
little figurine. Figure. <laughs> yeah, I'm standing next to wide fauna. Wait, can I? Wait, I'm... <laughs> We are the same. Uh oh, we're getting out of sync. <laughs> Get your very... Oh, I'm getting dizzy. Get your very own wide fun. <laughs> Fauna, don't come. Look closer. You might need a magnifying glass. <laughs> Look closer. Left side, right side. Da 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 da. Ba da bum bum bum. Okay, I'll read the super chest from today. Try to read them really fast. I'm hungry. And I have leftovers because I make more than one serving when I cook. So I can eat leftovers. <laughs> Alright, thank you guys for hanging out. This was productive. Productive Minecraft. I will read the super chats now. Eldin, the Ingo, Avi, Esther, Chiakra, and Paul, Jiro, Terranium. Thank you, Alunia, High Age, Sniff, Life Sense, Ismuts, and Sachi, Awesome Place. Benjo, Magic Bear Song, Seven, Lunar, Slenderman, Omelette, Kevin C, Spirit Vet, Misery, Original Shlake, Lunar, Tannis, Orozin, Ghosty, Jeff S, in the Mood, Kaiju, Red Knox, Side Eye, Anime Ninja, Yuzinol, Aster, Rolstead, Mortal Tom, Botan, Bishop, Thurman, Final Tomman, Sam, Luke, Evan, Tracker. Trino Boss, Cream for Rice, Copper Chef, Our Man, Sleigh Buns, Rouch, Tentacles, Chocolate, Katie, Aaron, Or in the Wind Trump, Dark Eagle Freak, Isaac Wolf, Stephen Adams, Bot Dog, Sayano, Riona, Sapphire, CDR, Jarek, Vexel, Centaur, Viper, Dryde, Drady, Inuhoshi, Jose, Casual Vader, Zipli, Awesome Sunda, Reconcile, Echo Sound, Moon Pie, Resistant, Stephen Adams, King Shark, Thank you. Luke, Misery, Eldian, Brent, Ross, Evan, Shushi, Kaiju, Terranium, Sunderman, Akronda, Lunar, Katie, Renung, Shake, Red Nog, Success, I Win the Wind, Botan, Mombi, Deco, Silly Buns, Bishop, Green Tea, Yasser, Sayano, Shimon, Kedrin, Candleman's Awesome Place, Arasma, Sunda, Therion, Kalmirion, Lumen, CDR, Raychan, Rasasin, Rionada, Kiko Freak, Meganet, Sean, Spirit Fan Master, Izanashi, Veron, Sentient Tracker, Green Tea, Jessica, Echo Sounds, Viper, Izanashi, Jeffess, Clipped Monkey, Great Move, B -b -b Buster, Sentient Bees, Drill, Days, Thank you! Plant them, plant them, gotta plant them all, gotta plant them all, Sapling Wrap. Thank you! Eldin, thank you. Kairos, thank you. Let's go, B team. Santia san, arigato gozaimasu. Let's go, B team. <laughs> Zoix, thank you. Oh no. The Thursday. Minecraft. Seven, thank you. <laughs> Me too, every time I see. See fauna, the word fauna, not my name in the wild. I'm like, hee hee. Snip, thank you. Evan, thank you. <laughs> it's true. Semi villainous seagull, thank you. <laughs> oh no, no. Do not smoke near my tree. Only you can prevent forest fires. Smoking the bear is gonna come after you. Super Zero, thank you. I will send Smokey the bear after you. He can be hired like a hitman, you know. Bishop, thank you. 
Thank you, thank you. Mikote, thank you. Did I have a plan if I ended up on an on JP team? No. It'll be fine. That's my plan. As long as I can play Mario, it's fine, right? <laughs> Do I need to communicate? <laughs> But yes, I have Iris. I have Iris. Glasses is good, thank you. Giancarlo, thank you, thank you. Said I cannot watch the stream. Have to get up early tomorrow. Hope you can make some progress. If you're not in the mood, feeling in the mood, continue in the tree. Do something else. Don't worry. I'm in the mood for the tree. Called it Minecraft Monday, not World Tree Building Monday. Don't force yourself. Take your time. Thank, thank you. Do not worry though. I'm motivated to finish this thing. <laughs> Even if it sounds like I'm not sometimes. No, 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 Mazan. Arigato gozaimasu. Spirit Red, thank you. Fonzie, thank you. Life Swordsman, thank you. You don't need to defend yourselves, right? You have me! You have nothing to worry about. The forest is safe. Don't worry. Misery, thank you. Jazz Keen, thank you. Oh, grinding arms on Switch Sports. Oh, they finished making new gotchas. And now they're looping previous items. Ooh. <laughs> I want to get the green hair. When I can figure out how to set up home 3D, I want to do 3D Switch Sports for sure. Steven Adams, thank you. Nagi, thank you. Yes, happy early birthday. I hope it's a great. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear sapling. Happy birthday to you. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. I'm freezing. Can you even tell though? Because I'm so small. <laughs> Happy birthday. Eldian, thank you. <laughs> thank you for validating my nostalgia. Blighter though, thank you. Jeff M, thank you. Happy birthday! Your 21st birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday, dear sapling! Happy birthday to you! I run the wind, thank you. Minecraft is old enough to be in middle school, right? I think that's why it feels unusual for the comments to be filled with middle schoolers still to this day <laughs> but minecraft just has that appeal Lathan, thank you Giorgio, thank you yeah right Eldian, thank you thank you tracker thank you mm -hmm, mm -hmm. lots of life ahead of you Aodamas, thank you oh how cute <laughs> Roka, DR, Kendra, thank you. Fauna, let's say that. <laughs> what is this? Oh my. <laughs> what is this? What is this? I vaguely recall a super chat like this before. Hmm. <laughs> Crony? I don't know. Lately, I feel like I. Bully crony too much. Maybe I should should leave her be. <laughs> Nigek, thank you. Really? <laughs> Cameron, thank you. Thank you for the first super chat. It's true, thank you. Zoings, thank you. <laughs> oh no. Ashigan, thank you. Really? It's amazing. Momo Momo Okami san, arigato. Wolfinator, thank you. 
Appreciation for the earth for the year. I appreciate the earth every day. We should all appreciate the earth every day. It is our home in the vast darkness of space. And happy belated birthday. <laughs> happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear sapling. Happy birthday to you. Yoshi Slayer, thank you. Ooh. <laughs> Skellum, thank you. Mung Bean, thank you. Happy early birthday to you too. Many birthdays. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear sapling. Happy birthday to you. Happy early birthday. Your birthday too, bad teamwork. At what point do we become suspicious of the amount of birthdays? <laughs> It's not your fault that you were born on the same day as all the other saplings. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birth... Happy birthday, dear sapling. Happy birthday to you. Kronos, thank you. Oh, Sky Skyrim Speedrunner again. Good luck, good luck. I'd like to name your save files? What do people normally name them? What do I like? What should what should we name them? <laughs> Wait, this is a big responsibility. Mm. Serana. <laughs> mm. Yeah, maybe snail. Can we name them after snail? <laughs> Can we name them snail? <laughs> Fauna was here. Is that too much? That might be too much. Snail. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Good luck. Have fun. How exciting. Mystic sign, thank you. Thank you. Rainbow, thank you. Akronta, thank you. A third you. Fo, thank you. Antonio, thank you. Another birthday? You are silly Billy being born on the same day as all these saplings, except that yours was yesterday. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear sapling. Happy birthday to you. Chaos, thank you. I do want to add that, yes. Luke, thank you, thank you. <laughs> this is a lot of... of math. <laughs> Pop... Poplar branches form three-eighths of a rotation apart as you go up the trunk or along a branch. Whereas oaks are two-fifths. The tip of a trunk ends with an apical bud. You know... The world tree follows no rules. I make the rules. <laughs> thank you. Eldian, thank you. Yes. <laughs> Black mage, thank you. Mold is just extra protein when you really think about it, right? It's like... A fungus. Mushrooms. I feel like mushrooms don't actually have that much protein in them, though. But it feels like they should. Herios, thank you. Nigek, thank you. Mr. Reach, thank you. <laughs> Lunar, thank you. Splinter Man, thank you. Mm, thank you. I run the wind, thank you. True, true. Black Mage, thank you. <laughs> no. Colin, thank you. Hakase, thank you. Your birthday, too? <laughs> Wait, yeah. Maybe we shouldn't have an existential dread on the day where it's everyone's birthday. I'm sorry. It's good to get older. You survived another year. Congratulations. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear sapling. Happy 
birthday to you. Faust, thank you. Bishop, thank you. Uncle Rupert, thank you. I'm really worried about the trades. Okay, that's for help and opinions. It's true, it's true. I have been offered some help. And I'm sure I will get it eventually. <laughs> It's just a matter of, uh, scheduling. But I'm not in a rush or anything. Dark Eco Free, thank you. A small prank for your housemate? What are good pranks? You could always do the office thing where you, like, saran wrap everything on their desk. Is that what they do in the office? <laughs> Bed? That's evil. No, that's that's like arson. That's arson. <laughs> Move something slightly each day. That's pretty good. Like move a chair like slightly further, or the couch slightly further from the wall every day, and see if they notice. I like that one. Or move the TV, like, slightly to the side every day. <laughs> Is that also from The Office? The Office has good pranks, probably. This is good, thank you. Driller, thank you. How not? Cute anime girls are the best, thank you. That would be fun. Unison is a really hard song to sing, though. <laughs> um That's the dead up Estella, thank you. Hi Fun, I'm back from Japan now. Readjusting times must have been hard though. For some reason I keep thinking it's Monday. I may or may not also have overspent my budget, bought two extra suitcases of eating grass for a month. We had the same experience in Japan then. I also ended up with, like, two extra bags of stuff to bring back. Thank you. But don't send me a super chat if you have to eat grass. Don't spend your grass budget on super chats. Did I eat grass? I did drink a lot of matcha lattes. <laughs> Bethany, thank you. Buddy, thank you. Sushi, thank you. Un... Do a da ba dee da ba died camel, thank you. Eldian, thank you. What? <laughs> you were at a friend's house and your parents took you out to eat, but not your friend? <laughs> Be drill, thank you. Your birthday, too! Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear sapling. Happy birthday to you. What's the most birthdays we've had in a stream? Magnus, right? Thank you. This is the strategy. Just steal packets of salt and pepper from work. I support this. <laughs> you like every time you go to Taco Bell, you have to steal. All of the fire sauce packets. You just have to. Calm, thank you. Buzzkill, thank you. I don't need a salt and pepper shaker. I don't want one. <laughs> Sadie, thank you. Exactly. You have it. You can't use a salt shaker while cooking because then the steam messes it up. Exactly. Exactly. Nama Kimono, thank you. True, true. <laughs> Skellum, thank you. <laughs> Tom, Tom Mix, thank you. Diego, thank you. Jeff S, thank you. Thanks for the leftovers. Jay, thank you. Luke, thank you. Do I make a distinction between leftovers and meal prep? For me, I do. Meal prepping to me is like where you take like three hours and cook a bunch of meals all together. Leftovers is just when you're cooking and you have like extra servings. 
Not like you make one serving and only eat half, but you know. Like you make like a pot of pasta. Like a whole pot. And you just eat one serving and you have more left over. <laughs> more juice, thank you. GM, let me thank you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, right? I have, I would also order food way more. I mean, I do order food too much already, but... If I had to cook every day, I would also order food way more. You don't need to cook like every day if you have leftovers. <laughs> Jackal, thank you. Just like Bear Song, thank you. George, thank you. Kong, thank you. I do have Silk Touch Axe, but I have a ton of leaves already. I'm not really worried. I'll probably use a combination of materials. Music Bear Song, thank you. <laughs> True. Minimal Sanity, thank you. Sadie, thank you. True. Hazu Toishin, thank you. <laughs> I'll, fin I'll finish the tree by Halloween and it'll fit right in. My goodness. I'm Prella, thank you. Screaming Lemur, thank you. My name is Saris Fauna, Gaming Kirin. Look on my tree, ye saplings, and despair! Nothing beside remains. Around the decay of that colossal slump, the lone and quiet server stretches far away. Star Creator, thank you. Rakta, thank you. Arigato gozaimasu. Binglan, thank you. Luke, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Tuna fish, thank you. You believe in evil snail, thank you. I'll run the wood, thank you. <laughs> Trad Gore, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Treat the sapling plush well. Akatsuki, thank you. Oh my god, wow, Puru just not. It is! Yusatya-san, arigato. LSR, thank you. Ari, thank you. Byukna, thank you. I do know. I do, I am aware. But thank you. Eldin, thank you. Tyler, thank you. Yeah, I've seen. I've seen Rubber Ross's Mario Maker levels. I would be interested to try them. As well as the ones by Dum Dog. <laughs> Those are on my list of levels I wish to play. Justin, thank you. Although I don't know if I'm good enough to play them. I guess I should try, though. <laughs> I should just try and see. Martin D, thank you. Speedy G, thank you. Bishop, thank you. Thank, thank you. I do. I like building the world tree and seeing it coming along every week. Justin, thank you. Life Swordsman, thank you. <laughs> oh no. I do think it'd be fun to like seriously compete in a gaming tournament, but I don't know. I don't know. FPS? I don't know. <laughs> Abandoned by Fauna. Thank you. Oh no. I won't abandon you. Days, thank you. Strawberries are already moldy the moment they enter the store. That's how it feels like. And then, thank you. Eldin, thank you. Justin Kane, thank, thank you. Luke, thank you. Oh no. This is that's very unfortunate. This is dark, dark lore of Peter Pan. Oh no. Pink old Daisy, thank you. Mr. V, thank you. Bell's theorem, thank you. <laughs> you are, thank you. Thank you. Okay, that's the super chest for today. I still have something to catch up on. Hold on. In the future. But I'll read them another time. I will read them. Worry not. <laughs> you can see the steam from my tea. Been big fauna in a while. Look at my face. <laughs> Perceive my face. Look. Just 
<laughs> okay, that's all for today. Tomorrow we play Dredge. I'm excited to play it. Thanks for watching. This was fun. Appreciate you. And I will see you soon. Bye-bye. 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 Bye. -bye. Bye, 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 -bye. Bye,